Doo -doo -doo. Alrighty. I am really looking forward to this game. Obviously, this is the first of its kind. Um, yeah, there hasn't been a 72-player multi done, like, ever. I've checked uh, across all the internets, and we are the first ones. So that's excellent. Doo -doo -doo. Let's see if the stream is up. I'm streaming all right, and I see myself live. Perfect. All right. Greetings, everyone. Welcome back. I'm Stefan, and this is the greatest multi to ever happen in Stellaris. Well, I say that we have 72 people in this multi. 72 people is a record amount of people. Uh, there has never been a single game in Stellaris that has had, like, even a comparable amount of people. I'm pretty sure the biggest other multi games have been, like, in the 40s. Uh, but this is the largest one ever to happen, and this is the largest one to ever be streamed. So this is the first uh, along many lines, and uh, we have done a pretty damn good job organizing this thing. Uh, I've collaborated, uh, me as the Grand Flotilla server, of course, uh, link in the description. I've collaborated with two other servers, Lorries and P Games and Legends United. Both their links are also in the description. And um, we are making a great collaborative uh, multiplayer. This is not going to be a particularly competitive game, it's going to be uh, more of a chill run. Of course, people will still die, people will still get war decked, uh, but it's for the good of the entire galaxy for us to cooperate and have great interactions with each other. So uh, let me introduce Chris real quick. Uh, Chris, he is uh, from Legends United. Uh, is, uh, uh, yes, I'm yeah, here. Yeah, uh, Chris is here. Sorry. Sorry about that. Uh, I was just grabbing some water. Okay, so we still need Bomber Person to connect Fate 4.0, and uh, then we can launch and get the game on the road. Basically, we have some rules that are in place. No total war, 20 years peace. Again, if you're going to war with someone, make sure you can claim from the outside of their systems in line format. Like, you can't just claim their planets to go to war. You have to claim, and their claims must be judged. Second, there's no in-game war declaration. You can literally go to war after anyone of your choice after you're 20. This is not a try-hard game, even though it is a tournament. There will be separated four-hour sessions for each game every Saturday following the next Saturday on three different servers to finish the grand tournament that we're having today. Again, you can check out the rule sets on either of our servers. We have posted them, and you can check out what's what. If you have any questions, you can message us throughout the game, and you must be integrated before we launch. Again, like message to fate if you can connect uh, our oh obscure our okay he, he just let me know give me a second a second you can go ahead and talk for a second step what what do we uh, uh okay okay I'll, I'll talk all right but yeah we have wait 73 players mccallson get out of here uh this is a 72 person game simply because we cannot get like enough people in the game okay. i was planning on making this a 100 person game but 72 was the hard limit Get Mikasa out of here. Mikasa, Fate just claimed his, his positions. We gotta get going. Yes, so uh, these are the settings that we're playing on, real quick. Uh, there are not gonna be any AI umpires because, of course, uh, that contributes to the hard empire cap. And since the hard empire cap is 72, we decided to have everyone be players instead of having some fallen empires or anything like that. Obviously, all origins that spawn in extra AI umpires have been removed from this game. And um, all the OP origins, meaning, you know, Void Dwellers and uh, Ringworld, have also been removed. But, yeah. I hope everyone readies up. Oh, I see. So Megasm was in chat, and so so was Klondike. Where are they? Because they said they were starting their PCs. Ah, Megasm was here, but he had to restart his PC. So he was, like, at the beginning of getting connected. Okay, we're, we're at 72 per people. Mm -hmm. This is the limit. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, let's begin the game. We have to go. Alrighty, good luck and have fun. Be the best Empire win. I apologize, Mick Awesome. I didn't know. Next time. Yes. Good luck. Have fun. Also, uh, I have talked about Chris. Now let's talk about Lori. Lori's MP Games is also a contributor to this uh, great event. Uh, Lori, you want to speak? Uh, <laughs> yes. It's great to be here. Of course. That's all I got to say. That's all you got to say? <laughs> yeah, I didn't even think. Alrighty. 
All right, the game is loading right now, and we are about 75% done loading. When it pops up, let the game seamlessly integrate. We'll keep it on slowest, and we'll gradually go to normal. Once we reach certain pings, we will reach fastest to fast speed based off what we see is less laggy. It's if probably going to be fast. Five, yeah, yeah. If you lag, you will be removed if you get five pings. Again, try not to lag. Do not run any other applications or third party programs in the background. Focus on just running the game and having a good time. Yep. Hey. Alex Zavari, thank you so much. <laughs> Blorg racist. I think my Stellaris crashed. F. Oh no. F. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Someone bites the dust already. Wow. All right. Who crashed? Everyone press F in the chat. Who crashed? Uh, Bloodstained Crow crashed. All right. No one click anything while the game is paused. Give me a sec while I get this going. I'm integrating the game. All right. Nobody click anything. Uh, what Can't what are even the... hit begin? There's two observers. I think someone did the uh, bad origins. Oh no! Did someone Not coffee and backup. Oh that no! Somebody picked an, a band origin. One of the Federation star. Yeah, this oh. is this is why uh, Chris's bot and uh, server hosting is so good because he has a plugin that detects any rule breaking and uh, it automatically acts on that thing. So that is excellent. Uh, anyways. Uh, do not click anything while the game is paused. Uh, that is a standard rule for multiplayer games because if people are clicking stuff, it's gonna it's gonna cause issues. So we are paused for now. Chris, can you start the game on slowest? Yes, I will be starting the game now. But due to that one rule break, one that Empire has discovered, that person will be removed from the game. But as we're starting, it will automatically remove observer slots. We do apologize for those who got removed because somebody broke the rules, but there will be consequences for who broke the rules. Anyway, good luck and have fun, and good best Empire win. Of course, let's begin. Let's go. Oh, for God's sakes. Well then, guys. Wet tent and radiant. Wet tent. Alright. Wet tent. Okay. Check him. Check him. He's, he's hacking. He's a hacker. Huh? Yeah. He bashed, yeah. D he bashed DC before the game even began. Have you guys yeah. actually established 72 is a hard limit? Or yes. That one? Uh, yeah, we did a so test. Okay. We had uh, over 100, well, we had about 100 people in the lobby. We had like 97 or something. My bot just cleaned up a but bunch of players. Have did we have more than one test? Uh, we had a single test. Yes. Here's the thing. But Why do we need... The uh, hyperlane generation would, would change that, wouldn't it? What? No. no. Why would it no. change anything? No, it doesn't? Okay, well... Hyperlane generation would not change anything. So we're good to click stuff now, right? Yeah, yeah. You can play now. Yep. No, we're not. We're in the game. We're not allowed to play. I just wanted to be sure. Severity, we have a bit of lag on your end. Remember, you don't, you don't want to get any pings because my bot will purge you. There's no there's love. Oh, so authority, we need. We love you. Like a brother. I, I wouldn't go that far, but. No, we love him. And all his bad internet lies. His bad internet? Well, his bad internet might just uh, get him purged. Yeah. F it's 100% it's, it's, it's automatic, so even if like I wasn't here, or if I got killed, it doesn't even matter. The game will be fine. My bot will purge like... It's not if you get it's when. <laughs> That's how it is. Yes, I am... Not the greatest at the game, but I, I still am here to send minerals and friends. Friendly alloys to uh, people across the galaxy. Until Chris wins every game, he just kicks anyone. Fun I'm here fact. to make friends, baby. I have a, I have a question. Uh, when, when someone breaks the rules, does their nation just get, like, purged by the uh, server, or...? No, 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 I can't alter actual client files, unfortunately. If this is base client files, right, so once they're purged, they become an AI. But that is notified, and they get dis disabled abilities to win prizes in the next tournament. So, Chris, are you able to see what particular empire they picked to get them banned so we know if there's, like, some fanatic purifier ring world start out there? Or... Yeah, I will be able to find all that out once I start discovering empires, of course. All right, Chris, is your, is your bot going to do the thing with, uh... okay, wow, went, we, just, went... we just saw the bot in action. I wonderful. Fastest and 
and the a lot of fastest are lagging. might not have been it. a great idea. I'll, I'll reduce it to fast. Yeah, reduce it to fast. Did we lose somebody when I did that? Safardi. Safardi. Well, Safardi oh. was was lagging the game, so. Oh, uh, well, my bad. I, I I thought. No, it's not your bad. They had a bad connection, so, uh, they of course had to be purged. I'm really shocked we can get away with fast. I am also really shocked. How? You don't mind ever. We can only play on slowest. Just we'll get wait. all of the people Just blinking wait. red on, on the <laughs> Ten years. Oh god, it's like Christmas late. How many people are left? Because a lot of people just got perched. I well, can tell you, there is right now about uh, 67, 66 more players remaining. <laughs> Alrighty. Yeah. yeah you got, you got We're going to be down to uh, 40 in one hour. Oh, jeez. <laughs> yeah, that sucks. Y'all going to have to change the stream titles. 60 68 players currently in the game. We could have had four locks dead. It's 72 players, asterisk. Yeah, Everyone's yeah I was concerned about this. Okay, 72 <laughs> players at the beginning, right? So we started with 72 people. So this is still a technically a 72 Pittsburgh person game, Steelers but we just had a quick elimination. Sadly, I, sadly, I crashed even before the start button was crashed, so we didn't even start with 72 players. I have, have three Spark perhaps? of Genius. Triple you pick the band origin, you yeah. would have crashed right away. Sometimes uh, no. people that pick wrong origins don't even get to load in. You fool, I got my servant, so is there any chance of um, getting into like one of the later sessions? Or... There'll be games tomorrow as well to make up for those that can't play tonight. Oh no, as in I got, I passed the test and everything, I just got observed. By, by the oh, I'm sorry, yeah. man. So is there, is there a chance of like, um, Joining in, like, because obviously some people left now, like next week. Yeah, there is a chance for joining next week. So, uh, obviously, we have a, a lobby of 72 people here, but some of the people might not be able to stick around for all three weeks. Uh, this is, of course, a three week event. Uh, so, we're going to have some summit, like, in we the process. So, about like the possibility of hot joins, but we'll test it out during said week before we uh, just assume it will work. Yes. And that, that is what we have to do with games this large. Uh, for like originally, I had the idea of having a hundred-person game, so uh, I went to Chris uh, to make sure that it is possible. We did a test. We confirmed that it was really just seventy-two-person game uh, that was plausible in Stellaris. So we just had to go with that. Obviously, everything goes on rationality and logic, and uh, so if something makes sense, uh, it will make sense, and we will do it. Construction Although. Although we've got this on fast, it's actually running at normal speed because it's hiccuping every other day. Uh, there's a lot of people who are slow. It might be the more stable on normal, upgraded. not faster even. I'm just yeah. letting you know people are currently bouncing off from Androke Flock is like Mangrove, sorry. He's stuck. 16, do you want me to pause the game to now, catch up? Don't pause the game. Pausing the game causes a bunch of issues, from my experience. It doesn't affect the my server necessarily. If I'm if a host, like I gave you, Laurie, and myself, okay privileges for pausing during mainstream moments mm -hmm. so if you need to pause you can yeah but, but just just saying if someone pauses the game don't do anything while the game is paused right correct he can he reconnect it during that whole conversation so it kind of worked out anyway okay so just making sure we are allowed to pause if we really really no are. only the hosts only the hosts me Stefan, and Lori. if you need to just ask the game to be slowed down but don't do any action yourself how can you get it slower than that? Uh, we will not be slowing down the game on request of someone. Alright? Request all three weeks. I mean, the, the game is already here on a normal speed, essentially. And I'm, I'm even surprised that we can run it on normal speed. Because, like, I know this is technically fast, but this is running as fast as normal normally would. So, yeah. It's, it's good enough for 72 people. Honestly, I am all good with that. Also, one sec. I just forgot to turn on... Music. All right, there we go. Now it should sound quite a bit better. Oh, I love this music. <laughs> oh yes, you can hear all the music. Uh, but we have <clears throat> 540 something people watching now. So thanks everyone for tuning in to this uh, great stream. And of course, there's going to be a vod of this uh, left after the event. This stream is going to last for approximately four hours. Um, although you know we might do a vote at the end to extend it by one hour, but likely it's going to be four. So, yes. Well then, everyone, I'll be off. Have a nice game, I guess. See ya. See ya. See ya. Bye. Yeah, me too.
instant bumped me because somebody chose a better Federation Empire start. So just ping me if you guys have to re Alright, sounds good. Lori, no! Lori's getting that red. Sucks. I do remember what you see <laughs> is not a real connection. Lori has a good connection at the moment. He's not. I yeah, thought you yeah. know who is like. The, 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 the only person that can truly see who is lagging or not is Chris. So trust Chris and everything will be good. Trust in the Chris. Trust in the Chris. Trust in the Burb, but trust in the Chris as well. Nah, I can't, I can't do it. Push the cheetahs. Chris is about to expose some laggers. The power of Exposed. Chris tells you. <laughs> Christ. Do it to him, Chris. Expose right. him. I think we need somebody on push to talk there. Uh, I, I think that person just uh, needs a good mic. It's okay. an L. Oh, that's Chris? Yeah, no! You have to have Chris to talk about this. <laughs> Coffee, your mic's permanently open, I think. You become the very thing you saw probably, to destroy. You probably just hot micing. Chris is intentionally hot micing. Sorry again, why? Nah, we just heard some, uh, some suspicious robotic noises, uh, from your mic. We, uh, oh, we're suspecting oh, oh, oh. your- we're suspecting a robot uprising on your end. Beep boop! <laughs> That's only if you're playing the campaign missions on our server. Then mm. you'd have to deal with robot. Yeah, look here. There's there's definitely going to be some robot uprisings going on as uh, as it happens with seventy two people. There's going to be so many different paths, and pretty much everything that can happen will happen. So infinite. So infinite expanse. Am I right? Yeah, endless expanse. You want yes, you want to avoid the dig site known as the endless expanse because it's going to bug and decent in the game. Yeah, uh, endless expanse is pretty much the end of the cycle for multis. Oh no! <laughs> so what does it do? Lagging. So, uh, I'm actually not sure what it does. I asked Chris. I'll explain to you when you research. Uh, well, it gives you like influence and a bunch of other things. It gives you. It. A it gives you a plus 20% bonus to mining, I think. So. I got a thousand influence last time I did it. A thousand influence is, uh, is pretty solid, but... It, it gives all of your pops, like, instead of giving an empire-wide, I think, um, modifier, it gives, like, all your pops individually a modifier, and then just bugs the game, and it makes pop modifiers decent. Yeah, that's correct. Ah, uh, Ripper, Ernie. It's, it's a good single-player one, but... Multiplayer, it's just not useful. But yeah, it's... it does. I have I, I have a system in place which will isolate the person who resources it and will automatically desync that one person, and then we just kick that person automatically. So, so what do we? If the, someone breaks the rule and researches it, they'll desync. Everybody else will be safe. I'll just kick the person who didn't. Just to make sure, what was it called again? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? Yeah, that's expand. Okay. To be clear, also the audience, uh, if you're playing a multi-game and you see the Endless Expanse, uh, can you unpause? Uh, and you see the Endless Expanse, do not choose it. It will end you. So is oh, the Endless Expanse like an anomaly or a dig site? Uh, it's a dig site. It's one of those uh, archaeology event chains. Uh, uh, by the way- we're not mm -hmm. gonna have Endless Advance, but... I will end you. No Endless <laughs> Advance. But... All right, I'm gonna mute myself for a little bit. Uh, all right, for the audience uh, that have uh, joined in and are watching the perspective of Praise Burb, um, we are playing with this empire. So we are playing as a mega corporation. We will be herding the flock of burbs, as you might have seen uh, in the loading screen, or not the loading screen, the kind of like matchmaking menu. There were a lot of burbs in there, and uh, that is because the Grand Flotilla is represented by the. By the burbs, since we all worship and uh, you know adore the holy burb herself, we will be trying to find as many people from our flock as possible, and eventually by the end of the game, we may even completely consolidate the flock. But at the beginning, we're not gonna go too overboard with federating with other people, and we're just gonna be doing some uh, friendly trading. We'll be spreading the word of the burb, and uh, of course, since we are playing from the Grand Flotilla we have the Xenophobe Ethos. Everyone from the Flotilia will have uh, the Xenophobe Ethos, uh, at least some degree of it, 
to indicate that, yeah, we are xenophobic, and if uh, someone is not a burb, well, that's a bit of a problem, isn't it? And also, I am saying flotilla by, uh, by habit. Uh, fun story. So, before I thought flotilla was an actual word, like it was some Spanish variant of flotilla, so I used that in the server name, but it's not. Flotilla is the Spanish word. So, because of that little story, we had a little uh, typo in the server name for about a year. I've changed it recently, but still, I'm in the habit of uh, calling it the flotilla. Flotilla. Yeah, it just... It confuses my brain. It is too hard. But yeah. Do-do-do. So, yeah, this is our empire. Uh, let me just quickly show off the species. Uh, we're going to be playing as the same species as a bunch of other, other people, and that is part of the reason why we have chosen to go for the Burma flock. You see, if two people start with the same species, and by the same species I mean same species portrait, and uh, the same exact name, uh, as in like normal name, adjective, and plural name, uh, you're going to end up as the same species, and you're going to be able to do migration packs, like get those burbs into your empire, and actually do stuff with them. Uh, as far as genetic modification goes. They're going to have automatic full citizenship, and as you can see here, we know of burbs um, as a founder species. So that means that someone else has spawned with burbs, and we are a subspecies of that burb, which is quite excellent, and um, you guys can try that in normal games. In fact, it even works with fanatic purifiers. So if a fanatic purifier spawns with a certain species and another dude spawns with a certain species and their species match, they'll be able to federate and do diplomacy as usual because of course fanatic purifiers have normal diplomacy with other fanatic purifiers, which is excellent. Star system charted. Oh yeah, I, I love this fast game speed lol. Uh, well, things are going to speed up quite a bit once we discover people and uh, take our time doing diplomacy. I'm sure the people that are uh, participating in this game have already uh, stream sniped me and know where, exactly where I am. So we're going to connect to other people and uh, we're going to be doing some nice diplomacy. We're also going to be doing some, uh, you know, player to player interaction and we're going to be keeping an eye on player to player interaction. After all, this is going to be a game full of it since 72 people is a lot of people. So yeah. Uh, also, by the way, this spawn, bonkers. Of course, we spawn with a single choke point, and uh, that is only natural in our situation. But anyways, uh, let me unmute myself. And, uh, oh my god, before I, made, I mute myself, what is this? Ah, <laughs> uh, this, is, this is crazy, man. This is just crazy. Let's blow the colony ship real quick and settle this planet. It's ridiculous what the game does to us. Alright, let me unmute and go back to talking with the others. Game speed, not the scientists. I think my people are stupid. What's up with game speed? It's too fast, I think. We should use no more. Wait, it's too fine. fast? It's fine. How is it too fast? It's too fast for the game, I mean. Uh, sometimes, sometimes the game end up ends up being faster when like the speed is slower. Uh, Chris, try okay after this year ticks by, uh, try going on normal speed, and we'll see if that hap that fixes anything. It, it might make it lag up. less. Julius is lagging though. Okay, people people start lagging like if a year t ticks over, but I think we are actually going oh. faster. Yeah, perfect. Oh, it definitely sped up. Yeah, definitely sped up. Yeah. Perfect, so we are going to be doing this on normal speed, and it seems like actual normal speed. Yeah, this is excellent. Sad. Normal speed is normal speed. Normal speed is normal <laughs> speed. <laughs> well, these floors will be fun to watch. We all know that red is fast. It won't be done. Oh god, second. when the first doom stacks hit each other. Oh, when the first doom stacks collide. Deliver to 6.24 pop growth per month. Wait, I just realized the homeworld of the burb species, the founder species, is Johanna's Palace? Is that uh, That is not me. So. Okay, I am in the far right of the galaxy. Mm. 
as is uh, of you course right. I, I am in the far yes, right okay far right. Hmm. all right please oh, don't take so that far. out of context all right it is Someone but i am in the far right of the galaxy i'm in like uh yeah i'm basically in the far right i'm just slightly below uh just exactly far right of the galaxy oh no uh, so right please uh, come in I... come in and uh, try way. to discover me if you can i want to do some diplomacy with some xeno factions if possible and uh diplomacy with other burb factions if if possible ah. that would be preferable of course oh. hey guys this is extremely important again i know i just got another message about this cold war again is not enabled so that means do not attack science vessels or construction vessels or exploration vessels that are going out in the wild until you've passed your 20 and then declared war in game meaning so there's no fighting policy no no like just don't attack anybody like you know so yeah if your policy is to attack on dead ships before you're 20 turn that off no cold war we don't want people like forcefully uh stealing territories that way or else it would just make things too complicated yeah as you can see you know we're playing with some pretty competitive servers in the grand flotilla uh cold war is not even a term i've never heard of that term before uh but in the more competitive servers obviously people try to attack other people you know before they discover their empires apparently that is a thing uh, i've only today found out about it so yeah that is pretty interesting. Uh, cool tip for you guys, in case you want to pull some pranks on your friends. Anomaly found. Stefan, if you're in the far right, do you see a black hole system? Uh, I see a black hole system, yeah. And below that, is there your choke point? Yes. Okay, so I, I won't take it then. <laughs> you won't take my choke point? No! Is it your only choke point? Ah. I mean, there, there's two two choke points. So there's that, that choke point right there, and then there's uh, a system connected to it. You can take that, and I can take this, and we can have perfectly nice borders. I'd like to just so, uh, be doing some friendly diplomacy from my corner of the map, uh, if at all I'm possible. I'm not sure. Is, is the system like the Afchafan? Yeah, I'm in Afchafan. Ah, uh, okay. So I don't take the system below, okay? Yeah, don't take the system below, and we'll have pretty borders. Oh, wow. Well, I didn't even have all assets dedicated. I just dedicated more assets to the server. I should go a bit faster. My bad. All assets dedicated. Full speed ahead. I love yeah, it. Dedicate that asset. Oh, Do you we have three guaranteed, guaranteed habitables, or am I just luck? Ah, it's just luck. I also have uh, three planets of Arctic mm. type. I did is I got four. You got four? You yeah. are a lucky man. Wait, what and was an the ocean world? What was the Ooh. default setting for habitables, Chris? What was the setting? Was, uh, one to two. Yeah, I got one. Wait, okay, randomized one to two. And uh, what was the setting for happy. habitable planets? <laughs> habitable planets was one, I believe. Oh no, it was one. All right. Looks like there's going to be a lot of planets. And um, that, that may actually be a good thing, considering how there's going to be less of a scramble. Remember, base solar settings are also altered by modifiers that are present within the Legends universe, which may throw rival modifiers of players that hate each other or have fought each other in the past, or teams together or players that have worked together in the past that may want to work together to do something new, or even... Damn, that, yeah. that sounds like uh, some pretty complex and some pretty interesting oh, stuff. Yes. There's, al there's also blessed spawns, which may spawn you with megastructures, oh, oh. and spawn you yeah. with uh, all sorts of things, and it's just basically full random, so anyone can get it, like... Yeah, but to be clear, this game is normal. It doesn't have all those things uh, attached to it. And uh, it, it's basically a vanilla game with some enforcement attached to it. Zoom, if you want to go to another channel, we can talk. It's Winslay to your north. Also, I may change my name. I think I need to do that. Yeah, yeah real quick, I'm going to add a couple uh, more sure. channels. At this point, we have uh, five different channels, except for this one. So as people start finding each other and uh, start scheming, they'll be popping to those channels. I will, of course, also occasionally pop into those channels to just, uh, you know, give you guys an idea of what is going on. Uh, ideally, we don't have stream sniping. I'm going to ask you guys politely to not stream snipe. And uh, it's going to be all good. It's going to be a good viewer experience, and it's going to be a good game experience. Hey, if you swap display modes mid-game, will you crash? Uh, you cannot swap display modes in the middle of a game. You have to restart the game. Sorry, buddy. Rippy dippy do. That's enough. The, uh, the right of the galaxy, the north right of the galaxy, north right, the northeast of the galaxy. <laughs> the nor the north right. <laughs> in the Suzu system. 
Are you near the shroud? The Arantes shroud? It's south of that. Okay. You're to my, um... Like, you're west. Yeah, there's someone what directly way, south, yeah. south of me, uh, who's in one of my systems, and I don't, I, I have a feeling. When you see the light blue snowflake, you'll know it's me. Do we have two guaranteed habitable planets? One to two. One to two. Hey, I have a question. Go on. So, like, um, oh shoot, I forgot. <laughs> okay. Where do, babies, <laughs> where do babies come from? It's a good question. Very good question. May. Oh, um, will Alt F, um, will Alt Tabbing kill the game? No, probably. I mean, I've been all I've Alt Tabbed and nothing. I've been doing Let's get another monitor. Uh, if you try to stream snipe, the game will be like, "Oh, you're lagging," and then you'll die. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only reason I'm not watching this stream. It's yeah, just pure so fear of like yeah. the game blowing up. It's not stream sniping. It's entertainment value. It is entertainment value, and I mean, the stream is mostly meant to provide that entertainment value. Um, I'm not going to be doing anything so secretive that I will require stream sniping <laughs> to be turned off. Uh, I will be pretty open about everything, as happens with uh, most of my weekend multi games. Uh, who's in Propus? Oh, Sneaky, you can open we? the chat to say. Alright, the chat, the chat is. Uh, like that YouTube chat is asking, oh, what are you gonna do if someone takes Xeno compatibility? We will purge them. Xeno compatibility will lag the game quite a bit. So if anyone takes Xeno compatibility, they are they're being an evil. They're being a very evil. I like how that sounds. We should just get rid of all the Xeno uh, government types. That could work. Xenos are so gross. We should. Xeno scum. We should enforce xenophobia upon the entirety of the galaxy. You said you were all right. You were kidding. That's racist. Ah, uh, don't don't bring politics into this. Okay. Is anyone near and the don't accuse me of stuff. This, uh, grave nebula? All right. To be clear, we're not going to be talking politics or anything related to current events uh, in the stream. Please. Uh, thank you. Just yeah, just no, no no political jokes. Okay. We've got a lot of people who've been lagging for quite a while. Yeah, right now it's bouncing off with you people. V I V I and mangrove block. We, so we can't talk about the new Shoot, I will I will stop battle. streaming. Yeah, all we believe in here is um xenophobia against non burbs. Yes, that is all we believe in. And uh, all politics will revolve around that. We'll have um, universe yeah. politics. We'll make our own politics here. We don't own politics, yeah. We don't do need nonsense. Yeah, we yeah. we don't need politics from some primitive world that hasn't even ascended to uh, empire oh, level. Oh my bot gets no. Uh, so my... Um, am I still lagging? Somebody was lagging and they got kicked. Yeah, I got kicked. I've been eating some rice right now, and man, this is delicious. Mm, TM. <laughs> Wait, what type rice. of rice is it? Dude, I was sponsored by rice. It's Stellaris alien rice. Alien rice. Excellent. Are you sponsored by rice? What type of question is that? <laughs> Excuse me, my I think, time will die. I think he is sponsored by some rice company. It's uh, it's all a conspiracy, guys. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. <laughs> Don't you dare mention that. Don't you dare mention that. <laughs> no. Who do you think owns the rice market? <laughs> no VPN. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is our Dude, I'm not sponsored by those companies. Stop mentioning them. Come on. No, it's actually yeah, no, yeah, I, I need them to first sponsor I'm me sure and then we can talk about them. You ever heard about Audible? Oh my god. You know, I, I wouldn't mind getting sponsored by them. I, I actually really like uh, audiobooks and stuff like that. Oh yeah, they're like crack. Fresh. <laughs> if you join Audible off this code, don't you get like a 30 day free trial? Oh my god. Lola, yeah, you're lying terribly. <laughs> reason, the reason. Lori, you have a terrible connection right now. Lori, careful. You're lagging. The reason wow. why we have Space Rice is because it's sponsored by HelloFresh. <laughs> Stop right there. Thank you very much. Criminal I'm scum. For a criminal scum with the human touch. I had a question. Somebody said something about other Discord servers, like chat rooms. Ah, yes, there are chat. There are 
you know, channels below this one called Diplofed1234. Uh, you can go in there and um, talk it out with a few people. Yeah, if Zoom, you're, you're ready to do that, I'll, I'm ready to go into Diplo1 or Diplofed1. Who wants to jump into Diplo2 and, and discuss ASL? What is ASL? I, I oh, probably don't want to you. get involved in that. You're too young for ASL. Oh no. <laughs> oh god, no. Oh my god, there's a Gaia world near me. I thought you meant... Wait, yeah. everyone ask him where he's at, because he got a blessed spawn. ASL is... I shall say nothing. <laughs> yeah, I mean, stay no, quiet, no, stay no, quiet, no, stay no, quiet no. if you want what's good for you. Uh, can you please I will also say nothing. Person knows where I am. Hey, my Hello! time is dying. Are we cool? Yeah, you may want to tell me where. Actually watching. Wait, bittersweet really? is saying Stellaris devs no. are watching this. No way. No way. No way. It. it wouldn't surprise me. I mean, this is pushing it to the limits. I mean, this is pushing it to the limits. You shouldn't time? crash. My network yeah. is. I mean, we have, we have done a small test game before, and 72, 72 people have run for like 30 minutes before. Uh, also, yeah, thank you, Alex Devry. Uh, are you saying humanity can only ascend once we get towards a point where half the world can play in a single Stellaris game without decent issues? Yes, once we get to that point, uh, humanity will have officially ascended. We won't even do okay. real politics. We'll just all play Stellaris to get fun. Yeah. We, we will be Stellaris. Can we try fast now? Oh, oh yes. The thing got linked on the official Stellaris. Oh, uh, maybe oh. fast is a bad idea. <laughs> is, it, is it going slower or fast now? Give it a second. Give it a second, it's yeah. It's definitely going faster, actually. I think it was just that one person. Hello. It's looking uh, Oh, you know what? Yeah. Yeah, so as long as we uh, purge the people who have a uh, slow internet like we're gonna be fine yeah so the, the bottleneck is not the server the bottleneck is uh is just people's individual internet so as long as we can gather the people with the good internet like these games are very possible and very plausible which is excellent i don't i don't think i've lagged at all and i'm streaming so that's pretty cool yeah nice by the way uh when slaya is streaming uh is anyone else streaming their perspective I was, but I stopped because I was lagging. Right, I'm not, fair. but I'm recording it. Nice oh, guys okay. hitting pipe spikes every now and then. Uh, I'll no, stream don't kick after me. this session to see how it goes. Like yeah. the second phase four. Alright, that's fine. I was just Plus. making sure. Who just so, pulled in the side team? The, uh, the bird palpal states, the one with the, uh, the Gaia world, um, they're totally not by the Shining Pearl Nebula, just- Oh my god. That's sick. Oh god. You're an evil that man. Myself already. I hate Diamond it. Diamond Pearl Nebula has a blast spawn guy. Oh my god. Has a tank attack. I am a oh. single bird. Okay, okay. I, I was not clear on this. Uh, Chris, how many special things are going to be uh, going on in this game? I'll throw out the modifier this. Give me no. Alright. It's the secret bird. I'm looking for empires with benefits. Empires with benefits? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there's. I think this one guy is just flying to the Burb homeworld. Okay, hopefully that means he's not that close to me. Is that can... in Reap A or it's Reap A? Anomaly found. Yes, that is me. Oh, are you currently building a sub -league? Uh, yeah. Do you want to real quick go to Diplo 2? Sure. Alright, there's a ghoul. Give me comms. By the way, if, if you get a request from the Empire called Praise Burb for comms, uh, please just give comms. It's for the sake of the audience. I'm not going to be doing nefarious things with them. Who does own the system Delta Puzzle? Hello, Vader. Hello, oh, Vader. Oh, I can't wait for that Croatian right isolated exterminate the bird. Random isolated empire to instantly accept all 70 comms. All birds are pests. I seem to have found fate. All birds are queens. Ah, seems we're both alone. <laughs> If she flaps, she's a pot. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, apparently uh, apparently the stream has been tweeted out by the the official Stellaris Twitter, which is excellent. Really? Yeah. Hey. Oh, oh shit, actually. Whoa. Yep. Congratulations, guys. You're on, uh, you're on Twitter. We did it, Reddit. Epic, epic, epic. <laughs> epic, epic. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I was here.
All Hi, those Mom. Mom. On TV. <laughs> Guys, all of the 30 <laughs> followers will see this now. Incredible. <laughs> well, I think wow. it's not 30 followers. It's a. Uh, it's more like I don't. I don't know. Stop what is the count? I the followers. I can someone check Probably real quick. Less than you have. Well, guys, I think it's a perfect opportunity to just start mentioning oh, all bugs we know about the game to make sure that they're. Oh <laughs> my god. <laughs> <laughs> How does everybody feel about sound? Nah, it's fine. Okay, if you're just wondering. Okay, one thing I would like to mention, and that, this is the only thing that we'll mention that hopefully the devs will hear. Please buff Sonic Ascension, for God's sake. For the, for the shroud's Empire. sake, buff please static answer, ascension. Yeah, please. Yes. Okay, that is the uh, only yeah. thing that we're gonna mention of that sort. We're not gonna use the stream to just, uh, you know, throw things can at we, the devs. Can we, can we but, plug our Instagrams? Is that uh, no, you cannot. Can the only thing mind? that will be plugged is uh, potentially the Stellaris Reddit, but I don't think that needs a plug. Uh, the Graph Flotilia, and uh, the two other servers participating. Legends United, wow. Global, and Lori's <laughs> MP Games. So I these are the things are getting fans. plugged. Yeah. And of course, my fans, yes. Am I the yeah. first person to get an L game? Automaton, what are you doing here? So when's the next normal <laughs> Later, multiplayer honey. game? Uh, next multiplayer game will be uh, likely in four... Well, like, the next three weeks are going to be occupied by the 72 player game. We're going to be doing a continuation of this game uh, week after week. But... And then, After that is done, we're gonna have normal MP games. Unless, of course, uh, something happens and uh, I get like a hundred requests Otto, I uh, need you to, to join, everybody. which might be a problem. Otto, I need you to kill later, everybody. Later, Pansy. <laughs> I need you to show them I love you, boss. Pansy. Who's currently exploring the Apon system? I am. I need you to show them Hello. why trade federations are bad for I'm you. I'm currently exploring Ooh, that. Who's that in Galpan? That's me. Uh, who's in Greetings. Dim? Who's in the dim system? Greetings, Dino you know, scum. Are you ready to be purged? <laughs> okay, That's any any purging normal. will have to hold off for about uh, 15 years, okay. so. And only purge the non burp believers. Only purge the non burbs Who's in the no, current no, that system? sounds like that sounds yes. like a bunch of B teaming to me. What? We can't purge non burbs Hello, Ryan. Of course, you can not purge non burbs Okay, I heard They're that the, wrong. They're the best to purge. Yes. But only to burbs Everyone else we kill. Yeah. You, you are not allowed to purge burbs because, of course, uh, if you are if you are playing as a burb, uh, the other burb species will be full citizenship by default. And I'm pretty sure you cannot change their rights to anything below that because they're a citizen species. Your forced friends. You can you can assimilate <laughs> them into your main one, but yeah, yes. forced friends. You can assimilate them. You can you oh, can hi, leave burp. the church didn't, of burbs. Guys, didn't, wait 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 guys, didn't we say didn't we say that um, Cold War is not allowed? Cold yeah, War is not allowed. Is not allowed. All right, wait, is that a is that a military ship? No, never mind. All right, that may be a military ship, but. Uh, that military ship won't do anything if uh, they know what's good for them. <laughs> Imagine oh, doing a cold oh. war. No, just oh, use to scare you, them. Lord. Someone found something. Yo, nice. cross that mansion yeah. you want to uh, you want to go to the different channel? Okay. If you're smart, you use the military to scare them out of systems. I'm posting the modifiers that are currently present in this game that do not revolve around AI. All right, where is it going to be posted? I just posted it in chat, lobby chat. Sorry, I had to duck out for a second. What oh, was Fancy doing? Alright, uh, real quick, let me just, uh, I'll cover all of these special things. So, Teams Together... Okay, so Teams Together is active? Yep. So, uh, this is mostly affecting uh, Legend United players, which are uh, part of the player base. This game is majority Grand Flotilla players, so, you know, I'll have it to explain... It can affect you all, too. It can affect us, but uh, unless we have played on Legend United, this will be completely new. So, and, and this is going to be, well. this is of course going to be completely new to, um, you know, the viewers. So I'll explain this. Mm -hmm. So there's a teams together thing where you spawn nearby to an ally from a previous game, which is pretty interesting. Uh, so yeah, it's pretty great. So you can spawn next to your friends. That is pretty awesome. I wish there was a feature in the base game. Uh, do, do, do. There's Who also the a rival modifier. Oh, sorry. Wait. Yeah. Uh, let know? me just, let me just talk. If you want to, uh, Okay, let me actually go to Diplo 1 or Diplo 3 and then talk there and then I'll come back. Alright. Uh, oh my god, no, the chat disappeared. Alright, there we go. 
So as I was saying, you can spawn a uh, rival to someone, you can spawn uh, next to something very, very special. Of course, there's not going to be too many of these uh, BS spawns, uh, but some people, some people are going to get lucky. Uh, there's a rivalry bonus, apparently, uh, in play to some other uh, people. And uh, there's a turtle modifier where you spawn with a few choke points. Ha! Maybe we got that turtle modifier. Who knows? It does seem like this guy has also gotten the turtle modifier because he also has a single choke point right here. Uh, assuming this system doesn't lead anywhere else. So that is pretty awesome. Uh, by the way, if you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them in the chat. Obviously, I won't be able to read the chat constantly. Uh, there are going to be moderators potentially helping out with questions. Otherwise, uh, I will definitely notice super chats. Uh, anyways, let me get back into, you know, the grand chat. Insight teen system. All right, I'm uh, back. Amy. So who is in the Corinth system as their home world on the right of the map? Somebody doesn't know their home world name? Okay. The North South. <laughs> the North South? Cool I'm in the North South of the map. If anyone Sorry, is what? near the Arante Shroud, it's mine. You can't have it. It's all mine now. Wet tent. <gasps> How Dang. dare you close your borders? His own shroud. Sorry, it's automatic. Oh yeah, uh, Nerzagul, can you open your borders? I just want to let you know that everyone here is dead. Everyone here is dead? What? <laughs> Huh? That's, that sounds really oh. evil. Oh, like oh, the hegemony. Awesome. I'm not gonna say who, but the two best players in your 72 men game spawn next to each other. They're going to fed up and kill every. Wait, are you part of this game? Uh, follow over the burb. <laughs> what the hell is this? Uh, <laughs> that was ominous. ominous. That was really ominous. Just an omen. I was scared. Huh? Yeah, but I'm just it's saying that even jokes. if they do federate up. Uh, you know, they, they might go to some battles, but they're not going to grow to become the biggest empires of the galaxy uh, because that I will that will ruin the experience. You don't Tell them that. You don't know who you're dealing with. Holy I shit, it's chilling. actually don't. don't know. Also, that, that voice is chilling. I have anyway, to say. Guys, How I dare like you? Uh, there will be war. This is there will be war, of course. But, of course, uh, for the purpose of being nice to new players. Take it easy. Yeah, take I'm it easy. On the newcomers, especially. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, I'm going to take it easy on, on comrade. <laughs> oh, shit. Don't, don't ease it in really slowly. Yeah, I think Ragunas is uh, is trying to be evil, even though everyone else is taking it easy. He's taking advantage of uh, this whole situation to Why backstab. Are we, are we oh, yes, no uh, I thought Ragunas got yanked out of the game. Nah, Ragunas is still in this. Yeah, Ragunas is a wild card here. He was uh, he was here in the previous weekend multi stream that I had on my channel, and uh, he has been the big bad in that one. And I presume he's gonna be still the big bad one here. What the fuck? Although, okay. Let's me first, boy. Silas. Okay, Silas was a really he wasn't a big bad, but he was just a big mean because he just came in and blew up parts of my rig world. It was a nasty thing to do. And I denounce him for it. Nasty you know, boy. No. And I, I yes. like how I'm next to Ragunas. That's nice. Oh god. Well, good luck. I, I have I have a trend There of are playing. fifteen dangerous players playing in the based off of calculations. Fifteen dangerous players. He's done the math. Yeah. Uh, I have a log of stuff inside. The code. Oh, am I one of the <laughs> dangerous players? I can't reveal no. that. I will not reveal anything. I can give you guys a few tips on who might be dangerous. Potentially. Alright, we'll, we'll discover them as we'll we go see. on. We'll no discover them game. as we go on. Uh, but, uh, by the way, if if you can, try to research other people. I know that will take away from your society research, but please go on and uh, research other people so that we can connect the whole galaxy as soon as possible. Alright? I don't want to research no. Ragunas. I don't want to. <laughs> I, have... I totally would, however, uh, I cannot. Someone is saving to... At least not yet. Not want. until I get the curators. Uh, Naxarian Bird Empire, could you open up your borders to me? Uh, who, who are you? Uh, 
the one left of you. I can be like, uh, no. Ah, uh, no. <laughs> uh, who's Air Hunter's verb order? Me. Uh, okay, I, I think why, it's why Air Hunter, yeah. Non -aggression pact? I want the influence. No, no, I want oh. the influence. Uh, uh, yeah, it's pretty standard uh, to fuse pacts like that, just for the sake of influence. Of course, okay, voice like, chat diplomacy is allowed, uh, but we're not we're not gonna think that you know someone has completely refused this if they don't accept non-aggression pact because non-aggression could be very easily decided with. I want to attack you. Go to war. You want to attack uh, me? Fourteen years, anyways. Yeah, yeah it's a constant influence. Yeah, that, that's the main problem with uh, non-aggression packs. Point yeah. two five influence per month does add up. Oh, also, you're a bird, so I won't attack you. Get next to all the people I don't want to be next to. You really are. There's like this huge power zone, right, right where you're at. Like it's it's I amazing. Know. A comrade truck, Ragunas, one of the three. Who else we got? Anomaly found. You got me. Me and I'm. Oh, wait, <laughs> that's so nice. <laughs> uh -huh. uh. I just reminds me of that trailer from 300. There's gonna be death and destruction. I am in the middle of all of this. There is going to be very, very much death and distraction. I have also noted that my life is not better. I am just a normal player in the game. But mine does. To me, it's a matter. Your life was forfeit the moment you joined. Basically, <laughs> well, with the, with those fifteen scary numbers up there, I think I am. Due to, but. Uh, I will go down with a blaze of glory. <laughs> I don't know, I'm pretty sure this bot probably ranked me the the most powerful player. <laughs> Chris, we heard your blaze of glory a few minutes ago. <laughs> Wait, I'm confused. This meeting oh, is surely a blessing. Surely. Surely. Uh, hey, guys. Okay, so, so, so get in Diplo, uh, Diplo 2. <laughs> so vague. Whoever I just met, okay. That might have been me. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone goes yeah. into Diplo too. <laughs> hey, uh, Art, I must, I must request that you stop expanding that way because you're kind of entering my place. And that's that's what she said. Oh my god. <laughs> god, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Big black niggas. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Bad, 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 bad. Okay. Wrong direction, man. Wrong direction. Yeah. Let's not take it there. We are PG-13. After all, yeah, this uh, is this is PG-13. Who's the fellowship? Wait, am, am I making? Is anyone Lag is fellowship? Lord, MP games. Oh, Lori, you always Lori. Lori. So, Lori got up. He's good. Yeah. Now it's bouncing up to seven lines. Charted. What's up? And they're good. So I must really request that you don't, like, you know, continue with this expansion. Because that would be unfortunate that we'd have to get into a. Oh, hello, like, fate. <laughs> Alien <laughs> scum. Alien scum. Of course. <laughs> yeah. Don't take that the wrong way, but you're not a worthy being. <laughs> <laughs> and I hope you die. I don't mean to offend, but you are literally garbage. <laughs> now, I'm not trying to offend nobody, but I'm just going to kill all these people out here, if that's cool with you. Okay, Colonel Sanders. <laughs> Fine with me. Fine with me. I feel so Come at me, Colonel right Sanders. Play like, Colonel Sanders, like, that simulator game. Testing. Does this work? Like, yeah, I heard a yep. testing thingy. Hey, Naxar, can you go to DiploFed 2 just for a second? Uh, alright. Who so here's played I... uh, Colonel Sanders' um, dating app thing? Uh, you know, I've seen that thing on Steam, and I I was really tempted to play it on uh, on YouTube, but then I thought about it, and I thought, hey, that's probably a really really I bad idea. I think it's the best idea. Best idea, really. Who's in the Fed Dima system? Let's try and think about it again. So, don't worry, Chris. Oh, I remember now. Uh, basically, you, you heard. 
blaze of glory earlier. I fixed it. It was my laptop's mic was picking up. <laughs> ah, okay. Yeah. Yeah, so you have uh, resolved the potential robotic uprising on your end, Chris? <laughs> ah, what was that? <laughs> what Yikes, dude. Oh, Big old like piss. Balloon animals. So it does sound like balloon animals. He's playing at the circus. <laughs> Who's, who's playing on the circus Wi-Fi here? I'm sorry, Elantrian. Uh, who occupies the Protrians? Oh, Bubs. Burbs. Hello, Bubs. Bubs. Number moment. Bubs. I'm not a burb, but burb. You know it's the word, right? Hey, uh, Teutonic Burbs. Hello. Oh my god, that's crazy. I so like that. So what are the chances of me and Ragunas getting along? They're practically zero. I mean, the chance of you and Ragunas getting along, like, no matter who you are, they are nearly zero. I'm pretty sure Chris has an algorithm for that. You, you will call me Juan Heda. Ooh, I get that one. Because we're the 100, and it was 72 so <laughs> Dude, 100 coming back soon. So, so, and I like, yeah, I can't contain myself. Hunter coming back soon? Really? I haven't heard the news. Right. You want? Are you serious? Film? Yeah, it's uh, it's like in a couple of weeks now. They need to drop the trailer, but with situations that got delayed a, a week or two, but it, it would have been out by now. It's wow. Okay. Out, I think in May. Dude, I'm gonna have to watch that like as soon as that's out because I love the 300 when I first watched it. 100. 100? What, 100? Wait, it's now the 100? It's all TV. You're Ooh. thinking of the movie, the 300, which yes. is based on the Spartans? Yes. The Spartans had two movies, actually. It was, it was the, the one that was after, which when they all went to war with, oh. with Athens and Sparta, and Hippolymus all, like, united against Persia and pushed them out of Greece. That was, that was old. We're talking about what we were talking about. 100, which is like a oh, yes, What were yes. we talking about? So, so oh, the 100 like, is a spin-off. Yeah, no, no, the 100 is based off Star of, uh, uh, basically the Earth is destroyed and they go to space to survive, and then they go down to the Earth and recolonize, kind of thing. So space Spartans? Uh, is, am I getting this right? Uh, space <laughs> colonists. Oh uh, no, nothing to do with Spartans, but I mean space colonists, uh, I think they should be pretty relevant to everyone who's watching this channel. I think it's teenage girl fiction or something. That's is it? Funny. Is it really teenage girl fiction? Yeah. That's what <laughs> did, did, I just did, did I just did I just promote teenage it. girl fiction? God. Don't 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 let them convince you otherwise. It's a uh, it's, it's a like trust me. It was so one hate 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 hate. All right, look. Whether it's it is like teenage, side. whether it is teenage girl fiction or not, I will still watch it regardless. The first one season hate. has butterflies oh. up in yeah, it. I got super excited. I got I thought I had curator. The first season was good. It has a gas that melts your skin off. It's the Will yeah, Smith awesome. movie where he did with his son, that sci-fi. It's that, but a series. Mm. Yeah, oh. but it's not bad. It's that, that, that was bad. I mean, in a good... Yeah, but there's no Will Smith, so it's sort of a trade-off. Alright, yeah, looks like, let's, let's, looks like we are finally discovering people. Movie. Which is excellent. Oh. Will Smith, what? Will Smith, in the movie, I just yeah. love Will Smith. Guys, I win. <laughs> looks like we know nobody, fate. <laughs> I just made a trade deal with Fate to to show like communications, and we both agreed to it and didn't find anyone. <laughs> Thank Thanks you. for your explanation. You can tell if you'll find people if there's like any question mark. Balance of no. Yeah, the thing is, uh, you can only do that if like they have automatically closed borders. If they don't have closed borders, you don't know if they found anyone. Oh boy. Well, I just Guys, found I a win. Leviathan. I got automatic exploration. I've met some non -burbs. Leviathan bad. Yeah, I'm, I'm also starting to meet some non burbs Which is a little concerning. Alright, we, we are finally starting to find people. And the galaxy is gonna become quite a bit more dy dynamic. I have been working to do communications in the south region. Now, oh, while well, we just found Spiffco, is Spiff secretly part of this? Oh wait, fuck! This is. Oh no! Uh, don't, 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 don't use that. Yeah, Lyra, Lyra, Lyra. 
The uh, Aunt Aunt Burp. Spiffco. Lyra. Lyra. I hope he's not. Are you secretly the spiffing Brit? That would blow. Potentially. 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 Right, you don't sound like the spiffing Brit. I, I, I've talked with him. So. Oh, uh, you don't sound like him. Speaking unless, of which. Unless you're using some voice modifier thing, in which case you win. Can I ask you how you felt when, like, you spent that amount of time on that nation and then it just immediately died under... Uh, I'm not gonna comment on that. Of course, you know, I was there to advise, uh, Spiff. I'm not gonna talk Spiff down. He is obviously not exper as experienced in the game as I was, but he did a decent job handling the Empire. Especially after he passed the, uh, special edict for resettlement, because of course, we went down the communist path in the Galactic Senate, which I normally would never, ever endorse. Uh, but that does open up the edict to auto-resettle people, so that helped out his economy quite a bit. Anomaly found. I feel betrayed. Has been we need to do the Red Scare, but in this game. The Red Scare, but in this game. Yeah, we need to the all burb scare. turn against... <laughs> we need to turn against the communist. Just a bunch of squawking. <laughs> Squawk. <laughs> I mean, robots are all equal, so robots are kind of communist. Robots yeah. are communist. This is why uh, the Grand Flotilla brought in only organics. Uh, no toasters. Hey, Stabs, when are we getting McCarthyism? McCarthy. <laughs> 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 no, you have added the the communist branch to the game. You know, we want McCarthyism to deal with it. This is e to alien, and you guys seem like you have stuff. Oh, the first Black Empire. They have a lot of shit. Three, two, hey. one. Jeez. My oh, man. I love the fact that you can't colonize a planet with an anomaly on it, so I have to get one of my science ships to research a stupid high level. Why don't oh, is it, is it a level 10 anomaly by any no, chance? No, it's, it's only Why level don't... 4, but it's the highest I've found. So Why don't you just All give right. it to me? Why don't you just give it to me? I no. have one of those worlds. Just give world. me the world, yeah. I'll do it for you, and then I may or may not could give it back to you. <laughs> Probably Sounds like not. a plan. May or may not. No, on the anomaly problem, I have a level 8 on one of my planets. It's not fun. That's an oof. At least you have planets. Yeah. Now, <laughs> the thing is, the thing is, the level 8 could actually be better than the level 4, because I remember getting a level 4 anomaly, and after researching it, the planet just disappeared. So, yeah, you know. Apparently, it has something Ouch. to do with metal. So, no, I, no, it better not. It's a size 23 continent. Yeah, sometimes the planet is just a hologram. Now, one thing that I'm really curious about is, uh, you know how anomalies are only visible to the person that has uh, discovered the anomalies? Right? Yeah. What if someone gets the anomaly that disappears a planet, but then someone else colonizes the planet, and they research the anomaly? Would that disappear the planet? No, there wouldn't be an the anomaly, and then someone else yeah. colonized. Yeah. So they would first get the anom. So like, thing is, uh, anomalies are only granted to the first person that surveys stuff. Like, that thing could go two ways. Either uh, both of them would get the anomaly because it's specific to the planet, or someone randomly gets the anomaly, and then they just disappear world of another player. That could be pretty awesome. I'm, I'm sorry sure that it's planet specific, so the planet, so anyone can discover it. Yeah, it would make sense for it to be planet specific, but oh, Tom, you know hello. that that's something that that needs to be tested. It would imply that um, oh them oh, colonizing the planet made it real, <laughs> which is I'm weird. I'm sorry, legends. I didn't I didn't mean to do it to you. Uh, no, but but it it strong. You're playing strong I'm and for break this photo, just like me. Yeah. <laughs> I like the way you're picking. It's the way to be. Better I just you uh, open orders to Birdsec. I open mine to you. I explained what we're doing to my grandma just now because she called. She was so excited. <laughs> nice. I mean, we we are technically doing a world first here, so. I that's what I made. I made sure I emphasized that. <laughs> she doesn't know what Stellaris is. <laughs> What a tarnation like, is a no Stellaris! No one's ever done this! I'm so proud of you, honey! <laughs> <laughs> I, I knew those video games would pay off. <laughs> Alien scum.
received a new location. Hello, coffee. Yo, guys, Hello. think about it. We're discovering thousands of things, and the real human, like, here, they've, they've only discovered what our gal- uh, Fuck me! Words! Our fucking souls! Words! Words. <laughs> cool story, bro. Language! Exactly. Words. If you have yeah, communications you with the- Use the proper words. If you have uh, communications with clergy of the Green Burb, uh, I just please send so me a communication people. so that you can know everyone else. I'm like calming everyone. Uh, who is in the end system? You might need to be more specific with that. There's like 12 of those. Oh. <laughs> Another phonetic materialist. Come on, man. You're better than this. <laughs> uh, those meta gamers. Like everyone meta went gamers dead. playing phonetic materialist. Barbaric spoiler is good too. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's you fun. Play. Especially when there's a 20 year history. Cool, hive minds where it's at. You get ridiculous pop growth. Hive minds do get yeah, ridiculous pop growth. Oh. In fact, at this point, I'm pretty sure hive minds are. I mean, okay, they are on par with machines at least, but they are easier to play than machines, I would say. So high mines are are pretty high up there in terms of empire power. Also, we have a galactic can of beans, so no one could really take that, and it's delicious. A galactic can of beans. Yeah, Interesting. Like, uh, in fact, I have a system that the star is not actually made of hydrogen, it's made of beans. Oh my god, I just- okay, I just realized something. For a video that I was doing, I disabled the tradition alert because it was coming up. And now I just realized that for the longest time, I had no oh, traditions. No! no. Oh, no. The inefficiency oh. of this. Alright, it, it has oh, been no. fixed. But as Yo, you can you see, know I am- Imagine playing so I'm not Mig Max. <laughs> <laughs> the worst min maxer. The worst min maxer of Stellaris. Yes. The sizes on the min and the max. Okay, I at this point, like so far, I have been min maxing. I have been max minning. You know, everything that I have as a maximum has been minimized. You know, that's exactly what's been going on. Mad jokes. You just min maxing for the opposite play style. <laughs> yes, I am. Min max for lose. And, and, and to think of it, I even built a temple on my planet to, you know, uh, make sure my people worship the verb. And uh, only now has it come to me that, hey, you know, this temple that should produce unity hasn't been producing anything. I wonder why. Because you don't need to with your place. <laughs> Oi, one of the burbs has shown up. Hey, one of the Kirby, I'm building a star base right there, so... It'll probably kick your ship out. Ooh, hello, comrade. Comrade. Do, that's not something you want to say. Hello, that's comrade. not something you want to say in this uh, voice channel. That's not something you want to have to say. It's oh, hey. the earthiest game. You hey, know hey, uh, Manku's Burb Guilds and uh, Pittsburgh Steelers, you want to come down to uh, Diplo 3? I go for them. Yeah, I got so many burbs. Right. Oh yes, finally we are discovering people. We got Papa John's delivery here and a bunch of other people. Hello. Hello. I have just met a bunch of people. I just met you and this is crazy, but. Oh my god. I'm gonna run now. military. But here's my number and call me baby. I remember that song. I'm gonna run now because you're military. So, uh, Chris, could you remind us how long we have to kill? 20 years of this piece. Okay, so, so it's, 20 years. Uh, 2,220. Mm. This got my first ascension perk. Mm. There's the burbs out here. Yo, what's up, Lyra? Hey! First ascension the burbs don't. I went from like 20 influence to 300. This I did too. I did too. This is great. I like this. I'm a fan of this. Scan the next people beside you. Whoa! Just hit me. Like, <laughs> My map just opened up big oh, time. Yeah. Okay. 
There's so many I'm, people. Yeah, I, I've been uh, trading comms with everyone, so I'm pretty sure nearly yeah. everyone has comms on the right side of the galaxy. Although we have oh, no link to the left side yet. Yeah, welcome to you. I'm sorry, but left side galaxy is best galaxy? No, so right side galaxy, galaxy is gone. best galaxy. Yeah, right, galaxy. right side of the galaxy is clapped. <laughs> okay, right Let's side kind of is nice. Which side? Why are there Holy so crap. many Oh god, okay. <laughs> I'm just saying, I, I just took a look at the diplomacy screen. There's someone playing... Um, uh, Winslayer is playing a Theocratic Republic, and he has a causes belly. And just a whole stack of empires, and I'm sure that stack is gonna grow even further after he discovers more people. I want to see his stack afterwards. Now it's gonna just—it's yes. literally gonna be lions. You're not gonna be able to see flags. I think that's <laughs> gonna happen when, with uh, if there was like a 70-person federation. I think that's what it would happen. Yeah, I don't. Okay, just just for test sake, well, we might do a massive federation at the end. Uh, but for the first couple sessions, we won't be doing. Uh, big federations. I, I really so do no want to. No seventy person set of federation. No seventy person federation. I'd rather keep it below ten. Really yeah, ideally. But I do want to try that out. We could potentially try that out before the next game, uh, where we do the hard join test. Uh, yeah, we can definitely try it out then. Lori, we have you completely surrounded. Oh, why is there a fleet with zero strength in my castle? I agree, Lyra. I agree to that. Let me see. I because still they only stripped have one the mods minute. off to get the alloys, so they stripped all their weapons off the ship. Yes, stripping. Uh, I thought that didn't work. Anymore. Stripping weapons. Okay, so what happened is they removed it in like 2.6, but they brought it back in 2.6.1. Or 2.6.2. It was one of those two versions, but it was so stupid. Like that. Perfect sense. That happened. I just like. Okay, my, Does anyone have a plan they want to give me? To I mean, it's a real historical right, thing. Right. Remember, uh, trade with clergy of the Green Burb if you want communications in the Southwest. Or me. We, we are both Potato Killer, really well can you that. change, uh, you want your system's name? BirdSec okay. is willing oh, to get all of his forwarded messages. Which one would you like me to change? Uh, don't, don't say it on stream, just, uh... Change it. You someone know which one. Someone's being an edgelord, are they? Someone's being an edgelord. Wow. Construction so complete. That's better. No, it's not edgy, it's Iggy. Iggy. Oh, there we God. go, was that, was that the right one? Yes. Uh, I mean, considering how you immediately uh, changed the right system name, I'm assuming you, you were doing it intentionally. So please, for the future, d don't do it. Please. I'm not doing the Raid Shadow Legends thing, I'm just naming all my stuff Beans and a few Beans. Beans. Alright. I'll, I'll take Beans, but no more. Uh, then beans, alright? How many beans will you take? Situation Hashtag no okay. birds. Hashtag no beans. Hashtag oh god the gas. You ain't got no beans on us. I just realized I was mercantile with automatic closed border. <laughs> I'm, I'm at negative influence right now. Xenophile, but you have closed border. <laughs> <laughs> we like you, but you're not invited. Dude, imagine the penalty from Mercantile, like, once you have discovered the whole galaxy. That's oh, minus was... 0.25 from Closed Borders, and, uh, Closed Borders to 70 people. Ugh. So we like you, but, like, we like you over there. I had negative 4 influence. Yikes, dude. A and that's only half the galaxy. Uh, by the way, has anyone discovered the left side of the galaxy? Uh, I'm I chilling here with the right where... people, but... I've nope. been trying to trade over to get to the right. But I'm trying to trade to no one has researched me on the right hand side. I'm it. very lonely. Take yeah. the deal. The left side's just a wasteland. Lace, left side is the wasteland. The right side is where it's at. I forced my money on people for for, for communications to get. The <laughs> yeah. Uh, always accept. Okay. At this point, at this point in time, just accept communications. Don't be like, oh, you gotta pay me like a thousand alloys for it. Just accept comms and we can connect the galaxy. I mean, I want the influence from meeting people normally. I don't think that I think that's the way. I can't demand. If, I can't demand things of people. Oh, I wasn't anything. No, I mean, I, I literally can't. I can't. There's no screen. For that. Half my screen's missing. Half your screen's missing? Uh, what? No, when when I go to deals, there's no demand. I can't demand anything. I can offer things. I can't demand. 
Because, because you know, like you were only to give. You, you were yeah, forced to be you're nice. a giver. <laughs> yeah, I know. Apparently, like, be charitable. Uh, cross dimensional, uh, cross dimensional Imperium. Uh, do you want to go to a uh, voice chat first? I thought he was gonna say, "Do you want to go to war?" <laughs> do you want to go to war? No. Yeah, yes. I know that there are there are some servers out there where it's like consent based whether you go to war or not. Oh, we have I've heard of that. Our server called Game O Two. It's all role play, but like, but so basically, if you if a war doesn't fit your role play, you can say stop. I don't oh want my to god! A war. It was literally six hours of saying, you "Go war me," but no. <laughs> oh my. That was it. Okay, just, just for clarification's sake, that is never gonna happen on the Grand Flotilla or in any of these 72 person games. Why anyway, cross so many people have such similar flags? <laughs> There's a very limited pool of flags. It's of because we're else. burps. Cross Dimensional Imperium, uh, just go to Diplofed 2 just for a second. It'd be nice if they added more flags. It would be nice. Well, I mean, there are devs in the, tw in the stream, so... <laughs> devs, how you doing? Yeah, I don't, I don't know if we have a cooperation on devs though. I know we have been uh, retweeted by Stellaris, but I am not sure about the devs. These yeah. are our demand. Well, they might at some point give us uh, flags or else. Might at some point make themselves known. All right, devs, if you're watching, uh, leave a comment in the chat, and, and no imposters, please. <laughs> oh no yeah, because they're, they're gonna do that. Uh, of course they're gonna do that. Situation. You know, if they're if they're watching, you know. I'm sure they'll contribute. Hey, hey secret bird, we cool? A quick question, can you colonize the shrouded world? Uh, you can, it turns into a guy world, I'm pretty sure. You have to first research the anomaly. Yeah, you need to uh, do the... Mine doesn't have an anomaly. Oh, really? Uh, I guess someone else got there first then. Oh, so did someone get there first? Make it a shrouded world? Oh my god. Claim the system though that you actually get a situation event though. Yes, he is right. Okay. Okay, so do it. it is Shadow. Do it. A secret burb. The doorway. Secret burb. Why are you just like doing the snake? It's it's called the wet noodle tactic. Wet noodle tactic. <laughs> S is the superior shape. Uh, I mean, cool, I've got a pretty bird. long appendage myself. <laughs> oh my god, let's not get into that. Oh, 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 no. I really hope you're talking about your empire here. No, he thinks family friendly, guys. He's talking about his species. It's like species game. Ah, his species, alright. Yeah. Uh, speaking of species, if we take a look at, if we take a look at, like, uh, the species map, uh, in my empire, we can see that there's plenty of verbs, and then everyone else's default rights are set to chattel slavery. Which is how it should be. <laughs> excuse me? <laughs> hey man, you're excused. Hey, the same here, man. That's kind of rubbing me the wrong way. Yeah, if you're if you're not a burb, okay. your default right I, is... Uh, I uh, I could rub you the right way. Yeah, look, don't take yeah. this the wrong okay. way. Don't yeah. take this the wrong way. I think okay. maybe you should rub him the right way. Okay, I so... Should rub I'm revealing the yeah. world, everybody. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, no. I will show you the world. All right, let, let's prepare for this massive uh, spike. Put it on slowest. <laughs> All right, Legends United, accept the comms and reveal the galaxy. Oh god, there we go. Uh, do it. Should we put it on slowest for this or something? Nah, 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 it's fine. We're pushing it to the limits. We're already pushing it to the limits. Push it to the limits. Oh god. You guys are all clustered over there. So this is this is ridiculous. I'm still clicking on uh, accepting. I am too. I can't ah. even see everyone. Guys, everybody hold enter. Yeah, you can do that too. I haven't had anything Oh, that happen. makes it easy. I literally Guys, pro tip, I would not do that because a lot of people have cheesed with freaking vacillation and all this other oh, kind of stuff. Oh, uh, patched that. They did patch it? Oh my god. Yeah. No, it doesn't matter. Mic. It's bittersweet. Your mic is of top tier quality, I have to say. Mine? Or, yeah. no, I guess oh it wasn't bittersweet. It, it was whoever, whoever was speaking. <laughs> whoever Holy was crap. speaking. <laughs> Little old me. I just met a lot of people. Receiving communications. We all um, did. Who knows everybody? Uh, the five burbs in a trench coat knows everyone. Or at least a lot. 
wish I could see them. The stupid AI next to me already wants to war me. Stefan, what is your place called? Uh, it's called... Oh, I just discovered Beth. everyone. What do you mean, my place? Oh, uh, God, my home system is called me, The Nest. Oh, Actually, dude, so is mine. Oh, I'm sorry, no, mine is nesting site. There we go. Oh, Holy God, crap! Uh, uh, Alright, right, hold, hold on, hold on. Don't, don't click on stuff. Jeez. Alright. Okay, now, now, now it should be good. At least someone researched me in the top right of the map. Alright, I have almost everyone I think now. Yeah. Dude, I'm oh my god, I'm, I'm still discovering people. This is insane. Do another trade. Oh yeah, okay. I will have to press enter. Holy. The galaxy is lit up right now. The galaxy Not is very lit. Up. Holy. Hey now. So many exclamation points. Sounds fine to me. Hey now, you're an all-star, keep your head up, uh, hi, hey! I, I was thinking about Stellaris <laughs> this weekend oh, Chris? with you guys. Influence expanded. Yes. Um, I like it. are we allowed to kill AIs now? Um, now past your 20, then you can attack okay. No, just wait till you're 20 for war. Wait till you're 20. You don't want anyone getting any advantages. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And I've, you want to reduce the normal speed and try... There's not much lag, to be honest. I mean, I, I think it's going fine. Like, this is this is a good pace. Oh, this God. is genuinely a decent pace for a multi-game with a lot of people talking to each other. Like, uh... The map has opened up. Yeah. This, this is insane. This is ridiculous. Ask me. Oh my god. I have health from the galaxy. I just met a buttload of people, but right. it might take me a while to click through it all. What, what's hilarious is that Winslaya has a causes belly on virtually every single one of those people. And it's ideology. <laughs> <Wow>. Yeah. <laughs> Vassalize god, and this is, this is ridiculous. Yeah, I'm gonna head down to another of West channels so we can join the anti burb defense pack. Anti burb defense pack? What is this? Oh, Lord. Uh, Disgusting. What Do I hear traitors? Nuts, then. No, all burbs work together. It's just the foolish Xenos. Holy crap. Shall we begin purging? So we I begin. Xenophile burbs. Xenophile burbs? No. No, there can't be xenophile burbs. They're heretics. They are denounced. They are heretics. They are officially denounced by the praise burb imperium. Also, looks like we have. Uh, oh my! God, I'm not gonna say it. we have over 900 people. Okay, 910. I can say it now. 910 people watching the stream right now. Uh, God, that is that is insane. Yeah, there's a lot That's of a people lot. trying to watch I this stuff. And this is insane. I yeah. need to use the influence on claims now. Okay, if you guys like the fact that we were able to get this thing up and running and this thing actually works, please leave a like on the video and uh, please consider joining the discords. So, uh, the top link is of course the Grand Fotilla Discord. My uh, Discord, the Stefan Annan official Discord, uh, and then we have two other Discords, Legends United, which is hosting this game, and then Lori's MP Games, which is uh, also participating in this game, and will be hosting the next game. So please consider joining those links, and um, you'll be welcomed to the servers. At the very least, you'll be welcomed in my server. We have, uh, we don't have bots welcoming people, we have people welcoming people, and, uh, you know, th they're gonna be hard at work, hopefully. So please consider joining the servers and leaving a like. And uh, speaking of that, uh, we're probably not going to leave a like for the space weebs. Unless, of course, you are also a weeb. God, these guys. Keep to yourselves, aliens. And remember... I'm glad there's a lot of people watching your stream at the moment. Uh, again, 
I hope other people can also accomplish bigger servers like my, uh, Legends United and get other things going like this now that we know other it's possible with just a few network fixes many things can happen we don't know what's to come but this is just a start a beginning of something yep many xenos comes many genocide and considering how uh how fine this game is running like there, there could be more events such as this uh if the game com runs completely fine for the next three weeks i will seriously consider hosting another game uh similar to this and uh, it's gonna be excellent you know if we can make 72 person games a normal thing that would be awesome Damn. And remember, praise Burb. Remember, praise Burb. Yes. Insert praise Burb. I think I found dislike on the uh, on the stream. Uh oh. <gasps> How yes. dare they? It's probably Cleanse. the weeb. It's probably the weeb. That's uh, whatever. Quick, leave likes. Cleanse the weeb. We 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 ex okay. We accept the weebs as long as they accept the burb. Quick, all viewers, like and subscribe. <laughs> Legends United is pretty uh, open to everybody, which is a family-friendly server. Again, PG-13 pretty much along the way. Uh, we host games every single day, and again, we don't really stream much as much because we do so much with programming, and that's how this exists with this 72 network. Of course, if Paradox can increase the limit, we could also increase our limit. Who knows what, uh, what number we could reach if Paradox is listening. Yeah, if Paradox, Paradox is listening, we... Paradox, look. If you can make a hundred person game possible, I will be, I will be shilling your game until the end of time. All right. <laughs> I, did I will personally give you my sandwich. How, how did you even accomplish this task of uh, making this bot? Nah, Chris, that question is blood for you. Blood and sweat, blood, sweat, and tears. Oh, uh, finally the Galactic Community. Yes. Yes. It oh, is boy. a worthy endeavor. It is. Uh, the egg protectorate. 2020, 72 multiplayer game. 2030, 1000 multiplayer. <sighs> Come run, want to jump on Fed Fork real quick? Oh. Okay, it seems there's a federation. Hey, Dr. ISH. What's up? It's actually just Dr. Ish, though. Oh, sorry. I'm very sorry. Federation is my proper pronoun. I apologize. <laughs> Start Who are you? Who do it one? Why is Burb... Why is cracking the Burbs in the Diplo what? Burb Defense Diplo Federation? Four? Yeah, let's go. Yeah, why, why is Kraken in the Anti-Defense Federation? What is this? Kraken? Are you betraying me? Star it, system it, charted. It, have you seen my position? What choice do I have? Okay, where are you in the galaxy? Uh, approximately. Top right. Top right. So, uh, your name is Kraken something? He's the Bird Keeper Keepers. The Bird Keeper Keepers. I I'm sure the chat is going to be able to point this out quicker than I'll find them, but... Do -do -do -do. Top right hand corner. Top right, right hand corner. Oh, I see. Oh. Oh. And then there's myself below them. I'm also in a similar situation. I see what's going on. Do not give up, my brothers. Do not give up. We will rescue you in time. <laughs> You'll be liberated. Build fortresses. Just hide. Just hold out. Just think, guys. Think of the bonus. To only have one giant federation fleet. You can attack. Oh my inside. god. They can't stop us all. There you go. <laughs> Which one is this? The space we got three bullets and there's seven of us. Let's do it. I'm up in the. Oh wait, it's the anti bird federation. Oh, I don't really care about them. Uh, kill, kill them all. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> if if you need help or need any hands, just message out to one hater. We Can will I have send your you. Hands? We will. Okay, that's just too much. We're not <laughs> cannibalism. That would be like the crimes against humanity over there. Nah, he's Vera from JoJo. We're just gonna be bringing in uh, over the, the alloys if you require. If you go to war and you need help, we will help you. Yes, we have a military supply over here. Hey, Chris, this AI is like already claiming my stuff, so I may need some of those. Very I stuff. will, sure. I will delve into the deep trenches of alloy stealing. We have sent some resources to help your fight. Thank you. 
I've noted I've noted kindness. Pretty much the entire north is My good friends. Will that help? Heck yeah it will. Wonderful. Of course. I'll be able to help another person in another five years. Five years? So every five years there's a good handout? A good handout of a thousand alloys, yeah. I see. Small loan of a thousand alloys? Or is it just uh charity? It's a, a universal basic alloy income. Universal I I like that, yeah. <laughs> UBAI. UBAI. One of my favors. I'm like, excuse me, I'm on here. No, I will owe no favors. <laughs> The tribute has been offered and received. All I heard was, man. If only I had that spaces made of mutants. <laughs> oh wait, you've changed its name to something else. It wasn't named that. <laughs> <laughs> I was reading what it was called, not even thinking. Okay. Wait, so was the Galactic Community made? It's being made right now. Yeah, we're okay, just waiting for say. some time to pass. Okay. I'm sorry, I really need that space because it's made of beans. I need beans. Wait, how are we making the Galactic Congress if nobody's discovered printing press? You just need the majority <laughs> of people. Yeah, you do need the majority. Uh, the only problem is I accepted this. I shouldn't it form like immediately or does it take a while to form? It takes a few. It, it takes, takes some, some time. time. Okay. No, everyone's accepted it. Hey, um, who's the horsey horses? Me. It's Silas. It sounds like I... Silas, yeah. There's an asteroid attacking one of my planets. Oh no. Sounds like a human problem. Call it that yeah, name. Purge. Purge the asteroid. Um, horsey horses, can you hop into Diplo Fed 2 with me, please? It's got 6,000 L. We must eliminate them. <laughs> Throw your fleet at it. We keep firing. Yeah, I'm gonna it kill keeps it. Splitting up into more. Which legend went with the traitless burbs? The traitless burbs. Oh god. Hold on. Okay, now that the galaxy is discovered, I can see about 40 different variants of burb. Oh god, there's so many burbs. <laughs> traitless one. Oh god. We're awaiting your orders, Lord. We are clearly oh, god. species. Send your burbs to me for mandatory pampering. Hey, <laughs> Are you on here? Uh, bird box? Yeah, what's up? Um, would you be okay signing an offensive uh, treaty? No. Hey, what's bird that? topple space, you should uh, come to Diplo Fed 1. Okie doke. Yeah, it looks like there's a decent amount of people uh, using the Diplo Fed chats. Uh, I might have to create an additional couple uh, real quick. Yeah, it'd be nice if we had like maybe eight Diplo Feds. I eight Diplo Feds. Yeah, it, it looks uh, it would look kind of weird to have this many normally, but considering how we have a 72 player game, I think it's uh, it's a good idea. Agreed. And by the way, clicky keyboard. Uh, I'm soon going to replace uh, my keyboard uh, with a with a quieter one. Preference, because uh, I'd like to sign a migration treaty. Galactic community boys. Oh, yeah. Yes. Uh, what what species? Oh, there's the birth of the galactic community. Yeah. Oh yeah. Ocean. That's nice. Uh, mangrave flock, totally friendly birds, autonomic birds, can you go to Diplo Fed 2 for this discussion? Alright. Lord. Alright, I have created... SCP 9192 here? I have created the extra channels, so if you guys need to use those, feel free. Ah, uh, who paused the game? We lost somebody. Oh no, I'm pause. I'm pause. It is the game pause. must go on. It's fine. It's fine. Oh no, so many people in the red. Don't worry, don't worry. We're good. Hmm, synchronicity or prosperity? Synch uh, synchronicity is not that bad. 
from what oh, I remember. Versatility. Versatility. Oh god, I don't. I don't remember. Adaptability is the best one. Anyone remember that, that um, Alpine preference? Uh, I do. I do. I think synchronicity, just because our greatest enemy in this is desyncs. So. <laughs> Yes, if we synchronize together, we will defeat our greatest enemy. By any chance, is anyone that has... Right, I'm sure- I'm also sure it's gonna be a great idea to support the Galactic Market. For anyone that is, uh, tuning into Galactic Council. Excellent. The spice and the burbs must flow. The burb seed must flow. Hey, can hive minds form federations with non hive minds? Uh, yes. Uh, Sir Flounder, can you, um, improve relations with me so we can form a fed? Sphere of influence expanded. Uh, sure, what's your name? Right. I'm right next to you, I'm the five verbs in a trench coat. Oh, okay, sorry, I couldn't, I didn't recognize the voice. Uh, real quick, I'm gonna go through the burbs and uh, get a sensor link from every one of you. That's gonna take a while. I mean, that is gonna take a while. Me. Okay, I have the improved relations going on. Yeah, what if we all just send sensor link to you? That is a better idea. Do it. I'm preparing for the spam. There's no way for you to, like, reform the capital session right just be Wait, careful what if we so that people don't room? like request stuff from you in the trade yeah, yeah. I, I i'm making sure also make sure it's uh it's active sensor link and not comms whoops also if you become the leader of the galactic market do not leave the galactic market it's a known bug desync Yeah, uh, I, I, I was the one who proposed that. My, my game just flickered and just threw me off. Flickered. And... Yeah, literally, like my computer just like turned off, and then I just, like, like I didn't touch anything. It was just like no. Uh, well, that's what happens when you use Ethernet, I guess. Oh well. Uh, see you guys uh, next week or maybe when you're in a rehost. Ah, uh, rip. There's no hot joins. There's no hot joins. Yeah, if if a huge host yeah, happens, That's what I'm saying. it would only be if the game suddenly crashed and burned. Again, I told everybody for those that I couldn't like in. I'm having another game tomorrow, another uh, back to back tournament to make it up for those that can. Oh, yeah. Okay, so uh, you can join that game. Completely different one, or it's yeah, totally different one. It's not going to be connected to the tri tournament. The tri tournament, yes. The Tri Wizard Cup. Now you know, you're thinking, making me think of anime, like we're all high, different anime high schools competing for God's sake. Ah, oh, God. I was saying, you sounded like a. Uh, weebs, but in, I am weebs Space in. Weebs. You sound it's... like Spiffing Brit. Spiffing Brit? Do we have an infiltrator here? So we must purge. Can't have uh, Spiffing Brit fighting any exploits in this perfectly balanced game. But it's perfectly Perfect. balanced with no exploits whatsoever. Yes. Complete. So That's many things are happening. <laughs> yeah. Uh, like I, I like the wait. What did you call it, Chris? Try tournament or try something the, tournament? Try server tournament. Try server tournament. Tournament. Uh, that sounds like a much better name than what I had in mind, which is just 72 player, 72 man multi, which abbreviates it to 72 millimeter. I just called it the Tri Server Tournament in brackets 72 players. Yeah. TTT. Yeah. TTT. We call the TTTs. The 3T. Wait, I don't play spiritualist, but what does a consecrated world do? Uh, it and gives you, it. it gives you mod. Okay, so I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. When you consecrate a world, like you, you only have to consecrate the world before you colonize, but you can actually colonize a consecrated world. So what you can do is you can consecrate all your worlds, then colonize them, and then get the benefits from it. Uh, I believe it's something like amenities and uh, 
it, it was it something spiritual attraction. attraction i think there was one more it, but it gives you uh, like you can uh, concentrate vault uh, multiple times and each time gives you uh, an mp white modification bonus to amenities can you really uh do it multiple times on the same planet uh yes i think you can do it three times on one planet really i thought you can only do it once damn okay well i recall i recommend all as at wiki stellaris wiki which has all that information I can well granted the into the chat. I, i'm gonna yeah link it in the chat but just a disclaimer the wiki is a little bit outdated uh at times for example when i was doing my civics tier list the wiki didn't even have the new civics in the wiki itself yeah, so yeah, at one so point at one point uh my video on the civics was more up to date than the wiki which is a little sad some random youtube yeah. boy is uh more up to date than the wiki itself it's definitely your job to update that wiki isn't it and what isn't it your job to I update mean, that wiki <laughs> it might have been changed my, my job is to replace the wiki i checked the wiki uh for the different uh ship types just going through them and the juggernaut one was like a sentence with no oh. charts oof yeah yeah okay, so it's, it's, the, it's the wiki the wiki needs bit, needs more or less bit, but it has a lot of details that we don't yeah it does have a lot of details which is good but at the same time the wiki really does need more love i mean ultimately i think the reason why there's not much going on at the wiki is because well you have to volunteer your time to serve the greater good and I'm not sure there's a lot of people doing that, at least for Stellaris. Like, wikis in general, like, if the game is small, the wiki is not going to be very complete, because it's it's a simple matter of man hours and uh, the willingness of people to dedicate their time. So that yeah, is a little I unfortunate. Agree. And uh, Legends United <sighs> games can last as long as we need them to. So. Uh, the Tricer Tournament, though, is going to be split up to... Patches of four hours each. We will vote if we want to extend the period we play, mm -hmm. but it'll be based off we decide at the end of the four hours. It's only been an hour and a half into the game, and it's only been thirteen. Yep. I mean, uh, we're, we're gonna be we're gonna be getting. I I wait wait hold on. So we're about one and a half hours in, thirteen years. That's a pace of about you know ten years an hour, perhaps, oh. perhaps more. It's gonna be about ten, uh, ten years an hour, and uh, will be people, and of course, will, will be eliminated. Uh, overall, I expect us to get to around year twenty three fifty by the very end. So it's gonna be relatively decent. Twenty fifty is the mid game. We should aim for there. That's good. Twenty fifty is good, uh, but we should be able to reach twenty three fifty, and by that point, the crisis should spawn, because uh, the crisis was set to seventy five, I believe. So. We're going to be able to deal with the crisis by the end of the stream, which is excellent. Sadly, Ragoons has not uh, had to die because of this. We will not have that crisis again. Oh, uh, yeah. We will not have yeah. the Ragoonus crisis. We will have uh, the crisis crisis. And if the crisis crisis doesn't actually happen, you know, we're, we're going to make it happen. Great. Someone will be the raid boss. Communications. Great. Comrade, yes. that was for uh, um, influence reasons. Use the great heavens. Okay. Such a great deal, dude. Also, I, I do not understand. People are sending me deals where I just give alloys. What is this? Instead of uh, giving gifts to the the praise burb empire, you're taking gifts away. This is not how it's supposed to be. Oh, uh, Who needs to but I, I'm not. I'm not demanding. Just, okay, just just offer. to clarify, just to clarify, I'm not demanding gifts from you guys. But he wants you to worship at a temple altar, sacrifice lambs yes. at his feet. <laughs> okay, perhaps, <laughs> perhaps I will accept this gift. Food one, alloys one. Yes. You know, <laughs> I, I, I wouldn't really want to accept large deals, but such a massive deal in terms of morale cannot be refused. This this deal is more morale boost than anything. Yes. Food is great. Food is great. Colonization in progress. Hey, uh, clergy of the Green Burb, can you improve relations with me? Because I only have one envoy and I want to join the Federation, but like, you've got multiple.
What chat are they in? Hey, oh, Fusion yeah, are in, you here? In a different chat. The Fusion, are you here? Uh, is there any Arctic burbs out there that wants a migration treaty with a? Uh, yeah, uh, I would. Burb? Yeah. If you're high burb scientist. Do it. Uh, yeah, just send send me a migration request over to uh, Secret Burb. Are there any dry burbs out there? Dry burbs. Yeah, I'm a yeah, dry, dry burb. burb. How about two uh, birds? Who is that? Burbidar State. One stone. Alright, I'm placing down another Temple of Prosperity. Because of course, that is uh, that is my job, to spread the word of the Holy Burb. Who has a, a tropical preference but needs somebody with Alpine? I guess you could say the burb is uh, the word. The burb is the word. I have a tropical. Uh, who who is this? Tempest. Oh, uh, what's happening? Oh, dang it, I'm lagging. Oh no. Alright, Tempest, let me find you. I'm on the top right of that. Purple. I'll take some Alpine. Hey legends, is Potato Killer 234 live by the chance? I'll be checking that in just a second. Thank you. Thank you, Tempest. No problem. <laughs> Julius is asking why is uh, everyone a remnant? Uh, I mean, remnant is, is a very good starting origin. And it's one of the best ones that you could choose without, you know, using one of the banned origins. I'm pretty sure the best origin you could choose would be Shoulders of Giants. Uh, but, you know, that's just me. Shoulders of Giants is very powerful if you sell your artifacts. But if you're playing a high mind or something, that's a GG. Although I'm not sure if you can even play high mind with, uh, with Shoulders of Giants. Can anyone confirm? Uh, Shoulders of Giants high mind? I don't think you can. Yeah. I think Prosperous Unification is really damn good right now. Prosperous Unification is amazing. Like, with whatever you you play, like, it's it's gonna be great. Yeah, it's like the new Gaia world, but better. Yeah. I mean, Prosperous Unification, like, the effect is so, like, so boring sounding, because it's like, oh, you got four it's pops in two districts. Yeah, it's, it's the most generic one. It's the default one, even. Mangrove. But it gives you, like, effectively plus 17% or so uh, production. Mangrove, man, come on. Pitch you go? got this. Are you here? The game started, right? No, the game has far, far, far started. <laughs> yeah, Top was starting right now. Right? Okay. Yep. How's it going? It's Pretty going good. great. The server is running, and the game is running. Relatively smoothly, I have to add. And we're on fast. Yeah. Remember when you say we were saying like no like immediate giant federation? Yeah. Have you looked at like the Burb Union? Where is the Burb Union? Wait, what? South. That's why I said. Oh that. my god. <laughs> hey, Chris. Like ten, so it's not like crazy. All right, it's, it's only nine is members. A bigger federation. <laughs> so Join the no. anti-Burb Federation. Oh no. All right, all right. No more. Uh, the, the, the true so, the true true solution is to um, create a bunch of small federations. So I'll be creating a new federation relatively soon. In 25 months, I'll have the access to the diplomacy tradition. So uh, I will invite some people. I am the nine-man federation will be on my fucking board. Okay, hey, <laughs> look. <laughs> Keep the language uh, PG, all right? We don't oh, want to okay. turn to Captain America. Yeah. Hey, um, Chris. Comrade yes. and a couple other people on our on the more different hey, call hey. are requesting that turn be turned down to normal again because they feel they feel like it was fast. I will check the settings. Give me, All right. If you want to do it right now. I mean, okay. 
more of it's a messy pinging off of, It's pinging off of three people, but it's not lagging, to be honest. Yeah, the people are in, re in the red, right? Like, they're just uh, going it's not yellow? off of them, yellow and red. Yeah, it's not oh, full yeah. ping. A full ping is when they stay red for at least 30 to 15 seconds, then that's a danger zone. Hmm. Alright, 30 okay, to 50 I seconds, yeah, that's a, a solid minute of What's them not responding. Danger zone? All those who are anti burb head to diplomacy board. Hey, can I ask why there are so many people voting against the black market? What's wrong hey, with Chris? you? <laughs> well, yeah, what's wrong with you? I mean, trade is bad. Trade is great. No, there's literally like 10 nations that are against <laughs> Did someone say my name? Yeah, if we have resources, we'll grow it. too decadent and God will strike us down. Oh no. Do you want to try slowing it down to normal? <laughs> but it seems like it's going fast. Uh, Chris, can you try slowing it down to normal? Just for test sake. We'll just uh, see who the thing is. I'm looking at the speed anyway, give it a sec. Yeah, speed actually is improved by about 3 seconds. Alright. That's great. Ooh, two seconds. <laughs> better than uh, no. nothing. It adds it's 2.2 seconds. Sorry. Hey, if it's better, okay, it's better. Yeah, that's just not <laughs> if it's better, it's better. Let's go with uh, the best option. Looks like everyone is uh, able to handle the speed, which is excellent. I don't know. My, my computer is trying to... Legend soon. Would you like to be part of the... Burb Beans Federation. Burb Beans Federation. God. I'll be making the Galactic Union very soon. It'll be just a friendly trading guild. I'm not going to be engaging in any wars. I'm just going to be making a beacon of hope for the galaxy. I don't know. Yeah, okay. Union sounds pretty communist. A union yeah, does you... sound pretty communist. But isn't, you know isn't that like the hope of the galaxy? We are going to create something that is a socialist environment. Oh, yes. no. I'm sorry, but this is that a strict. That sounds McCarthy's even worse. Game. Yeah, yeah, it's a joke because. Because <laughs> uh, other Canada. I think Canada's Oh, my God. Socialism. You Canadians. I know, right? Yeah. Yeah. As an American, I, I protest that, and uh, I shall create a purely capitalist alliance. It will be a trade yeah. league. Remember yeah. to go under con under species and set Canadian default rights to under. Indentured servitude, same thing. Indentured servitude. The flock does not understand what the, this what this trade is you speak of. I don't speak barbarian. Say again. Oh god. Looks like we have some shade getting thrown around. Oh shit. <gasps> Look, if the birds wanted to communicate, they'd speak like real, um, you know, sentient races instead of going bar, bar, bar and flapping their beaks or. Heresy. I'm, I'm Heresy. Sorry, flapping their beaks? Flapping their beaks. Purge. I don't think this man knows how burbs work. We already got a 10 player fed, guys. No, can we just... Yeah, no, no more than 10 players in a fed. That's lame. We need an even bigger fed to crush the fed. Think about what, what you're doing. You're gonna cause a massive fed. You'll have all your assets in one federation fleet, then what, like, three players attack you, you're dead. How are you gonna exactly. dedicate the one fleet fun. place? Fun. Fun watching your empire burn. You get some marshmallows, you know, just sit back, relax. <laughs> uh, See, losing is fun. Oh, I know. Trust me, I lose often. <laughs> <laughs> Vic, uh, Chris, you're just not on the play. You should, like, disappear. And then you get eaten. Hey, I'm here. I oh, feel everything. Oh, very nice. Dimensional portal black. <laughs> uh, dark yo, matter. Yo, that, that, that bed down there looks juiced. I'm just... <laughs> that's what a lot of people play. Thank you. <laughs> Alright. Uh, oh, wow. There, there's really only just uh, me and uh, Nergazul out here being burbs. <laughs> we are oh. literally surrounded by non burbs. What is this? I, I, I'm up here too, surrounded by non burbs. Stefan? Yes. My bot spawned on the opposite side of the galaxy. Exactly. 
Hey Flounder, can you hop in Diplo 2? Your bot spawn on the inside of the galaxy. Oh yeah. my god, it's the it's the modified probe. He just attacked me. How's it going, guys? You're, you're sending. Subjects. Voluntary is allowed, yes. I will teach oh, you, little one. But yeah, it looks like Chris just sent a modified probe to my side of the galaxy to disrupt my efforts of building a station. This is an evil act that will never be forgotten. I didn't do such a thing. I said that we are like a split across from each other. Like I'm on the left, you're on the right. Ah, I thought you said you said you sent a robot towards me, and I was like, ah, God. So this uh, you this, this sub sublight probe, it must be of your doing. <laughs> you misheard me. You you know, refit refit those, I, I will still best. believe that you are at fault for this uh, this trade probe. I, I will never forget, and I will never forgive. Hey, World of Warcraft, calm down a bit there. <laughs> it's not the Forsaken's problem right now. <laughs> we give tribute to our Lord Burb. Oh my I god, I just got a scientist that has Spark of Genius and Maniacal. It's pretty good. If you take out the leader, the rest will fly away. But who is the leader? The rest will fly away. <laughs> Which one? Who is leading? Burb is the word. Hmm? A secret burb. Yeah. We're cool, right? That's, uh, Who are you? I'm. Oh, well, what am I? Oh. Uh, I'm are you Burb the Galactic? No, I am. I am the Ascendancy next to you. On your right. I am the Senate. No, not the Senate. I am the Senate. Senate. Well, I can be that. Yeah, yeah, no, no worries. I'm a pacifist burb. Ah, great. One pacifist one. burb. As long as you're not xenophilic, you're sort of okay. On that the Grand Flotilla like server, thing. on the Grand Flotilla server, we have one, one guy called Leaf, the fanatic pacifist, who for the past uh, months has been playing uh, fanatic pacifists. He hasn't been played in. He hasn't been playing in the games for a while, but he, he was the fanatic pacifist meme. And, uh, of course, as a fanatic pacifist, uh, the whole galaxy was revolted by his actions. We have a meme on our server, too. <laughs> <laughs> Air, do you want to tell him? Uh, oh, one I think... Oh, oh, the pause uh, Yes. Oh, so we have one guy, right? He's called Victor. See, okay. mm -hmm. He has a trend, or rather, bond with the 13th place on the leaderboard. Mm. So he's he's been he's been right like right there for a good while. Uh, he can't really move up or down. I think he's got that. plot armor. Plot armor. In, in, in games, he he'll come in thirteenth place <laughs> every time, <laughs> and it's just become a joke. And then like it's like waiting for Victor to pass thirteenth place, and it shows a skeleton. <laughs> <laughs> You will actively beat him down, uh, or, or let, push him up if you get if something goes wrong. I think I'm gonna throw some of these jokes. Uh, <laughs> beat him down until he's placed 13. I like it. Uh, yeah, and then if he's not placed 13, we have to lift him up because that can't. Because if we're bolting, then there's. <laughs> oh lord. Where's the main channel? Ah, found it. <laughs> but this one's classic. Is there any burp with the uh, arid type world? <laughs> uh, yeah, I have Savannah. Communications. If you've seen that anime, you'll get that joke. Oh god, I have not it seen that anime. The space weebs have found themselves in <laughs> Erla. <laughs> the space weebs they spread their influence. This is oh, funny. I know that. I know this that. actually happened. This actually happened. <laughs> They're doing place. Oh no. <laughs> Jeez. My planet Black is crimey. Galactic Mark. Mark is gonna take out the Yeah, if you if, by the way, if you're watching and you wanna see the memes that are getting posted in the memes channel, please join the Grand Flotilla. Uh link wow. is in the description. Wanna, wanna see even better memes. Wanna see what uh, legends. Stay. Well Who currently the memes them? are concentrated in uh, the Grand Flotilla. Yeah, I'm throwing them and sharing them in Flotilla. Stay. Yes. Yeah, Chris is being a generous. Team. Ha <laughs> ha.
<laughs> if only you guys knew. You guys should just join up. Just don't join us. Just, hey. uh, just to meet Victor. <laughs> He'll be there most likely tomorrow. <laughs> he's there every day. He's he's there too often. He's there too often. No. Yeah. I love this one. You guys can actually take him. He's gonna kill me for this. <laughs> <laughs> I think you're having a meme off with this um, with this other person. <laughs> oh. Alright. I'm curious. So I, I know this stream is is going pretty well on YouTube, but let's check my Twitch. Let's see if there's people watching on Twitch. On my uh long forgotten Twitch channel. Let's see. Oh, 34 people. What's up, guys? How's it going? I'd like to give a, a quick shout out to my my fellows over on Twitch. If you are interested in joining the Twitch, uh, I'm sure one of my mods will post the link in the chat. But yeah, I do have a Twitch as well as a YouTube. Obviously, I neglect my Twitch as much as possible, but sometimes, you know, you can come in and get a message read. All right, StrikeCraft, excellent. This one's extremely important for everybody that's playing Stellaris right now. That last one ain't right. That last one is great. I approve of the last one. Guys haven't felt it hasn't hit your your twenty two hundred. Okay, to be true, yeah, it hasn't you hit your twenty yeah. yet. The purges have not yet begun. Because it, as soon as that happens, oh ho ho. Oh ho ho. Oh ho ho. Hippity hoppity. Someone's Don't worry about this guy, guys. Don't worry about him. Northern Burb Alliance. Uh, okay. The the Burb Alliance in the south should rename themselves to the South Burb Alliance, and then I'll create the East Burb Alliance. And, we, and now we can tell, we can see which one dies first. West Burb Alliance. <laughs> West yeah. Burb Alliance, yes. Uh, hey, Urfe. Hey. Uh, can you real quick hop in the Diplo chat with um Seb? Ooh. Ooh, this plotting and scheming going on. Uh, Northern Booth uh, Alliance. So, Can Diplo you... Fed 2, please. Want to try fastest? Two seconds, see if it's okay. Yeah, let's Dude, do it. Dude, if we do fastest, oh, I. It's, no, it's a fastest, big risk. Fast, not to say. Not bad. Okay, fast. Fastest would be like. Yikes. Yeah, yeah. Miss. Uh... Northern Booth Alliance. Come on. Oh, I love this. Looks like we, we have beebs getting generated live. Perfect. Thank you, uh, Justine Shekelsberg, for your contributions. You're welcome, baby. Lord, I am uh, Thor. I'll hop in a separate thing, Silas. Uh, uh, it's the Northern Bird Alliance. The one to the north. Yeah. Yeah. I was thinking about joining them, potentially. I mean, I am a bird. You are a bird. Stick together. The world By the way, guys, extremely important. This is very relevant to this game. Go on. Oh my god. The suspense is killing me. I'm on the edge of my seat. Nearly full. I'm tense. I'm really tense right now. My butt seats are. Oh, you already posted? Okay. How to deal with heresy. We're moving forward with our plan to reduce senseless trooper deaths. No way. Yes way. Yes. He's being heretic. He's being a heretic because he says no. Yes. You, you never say no. <laughs> you don't say no. You don't say no in these situations. Uh, he's being too literal. <laughs> no, <that's no> <laughs> All burbs are disgusting creatures. 
All I verbs are green. Oh no, someone's leaving a the Burb Union. No. Oh, shit. Uh, by the way, Burb Union, name it uh, the Southern. Southern Burbs, <laughs> please. <laughs> oh god. Anyway, I need to put that. Yo, you could bend, you could move that all the way back to year 2205, two, because fuck me, he does not want that long. Dude, okay, for real. Uh, don't don't be swearing on the stream. Or I I will have to sorry, mute you. Sorry, like you have sorry. been you've been doing that repeatedly. Please. Guys, come on. Everything changed when the fire burbs attack. <laughs> <laughs> don't make me angry, dude. Or I will. The burbs are collapsing under their own weakness. No, the burbs will never collapse. I like your style. So wait a minute. The Soon style there will be another the burb federation. Stop. The burbs will rise again. Yes. Why is there so much crime? Crime is good. Do you got a criminal, a criminal syndicate screwing you up? I guess so. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'll make a deal with these crime lords. The Northern Burb Alliance is literally the same color as the Anti Burb Alliance. Uh, Danger. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go to a different chat. Alright. Uh, Danger Bay, how's everyone talking? Using Discord, joining alliance groups, is everyone in one chat? Uh, so the system that we're doing is everyone is in the Grand Flotilla. Uh, we have one main chat, and if people need to go and do something with other people, like a plot or scheme or something like that, uh, they can go to a separate channel. So we have like 10 channels uh, dedicated for this event, and uh, people are using those to communicate. And uh, Alex DeVry, thank you for the two euros. Doris needs the RimWorld Peg Leg Ascension. I completely agree. RimWorld, by the way, is an excellent game. I, I love it. And of course, uh, doing things like, you know, installing Peg Legs on your prisoners is also the best way to play uh, RimWorld. I am almost with Stellaris. Like, RimWorld is uh, kind of like Stellaris, except, you know, when the colonization process is actually happening. I can imagine every time you colonize a new planet, RimWorld starts. And then uh, one of those uh, massive, you know, colonies with their death box eventually becomes the supreme ruler of the planet, and then they get integrated into the greater realm. But that's just me. All right, I'm going to unmute myself. Yeah, I'm still looking for a dry bird, and I provide wet birds. You have the wet birds? Oh god. Yeah, like penguins. Love penguins, man. They're penguins awesome. are great. Really are. Penguins are like birds Aww. that realized how terrible birds are and tried to be fish instead. And I respect <laughs> them. Birds. That's how penguins were born. Nergazul accept the East the Burb Council of Federation. Legends is taking over the memes right now. <laughs> My lord, may I join this East Burb Alliance? Ah, uh, who speaks? Tempest. Tempest. Oh, I see you. Uh, yeah, let me just... Okay, I, I have to send an envoy to improve relations first. Yeah, no I, I can't yet, but I will do soon. Yeah. Oh no, I can't sell artifacts. Nergazul, please uh, send your envoys and uh, invite more burbs into the east. I have asked to join. Sure. As have I. Wonderful. Power is hating us. You know what the funniest meme is? Power is hating us. I just claimed Albania. You claimed Albania? Are you Mussolini by any chance? No, actually, I'm not. <laughs> I was hoping we would have uh, Mussolini come back just for this game. It's a pretty good historical joke, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Technology secured. Yeah, 
Yeah, they're pretty much going the same speed. Narwhal and Path. Alright, let's see, we have four Burb Empires in this East Burb Alliance. Let's see if there's any more that can join. Uh, wet tent, maybe? It's southeast. Uh, uh, I, I can join. I'm towards the center. Secret Burbs. Secret I just got some envoy. Ah, yes. We shall invite you. Now, there's the first Galactic Empire immediately to your left, Stefan. Oh, yeah, you are Burbs. Uh, yeah, I'll improve the races as soon as possible and I'll invite you. Communications. <laughs> the first Galactic Empire, I like this. Do I want to join this? Is there any is there any downside to joining a federation? Right? There is no downside. No. Only benefit. Influence, influence. Oh, okay, influence. Te technically, technically influence, but there's more benefits yeah. than negatives. Well, Stefan, you gotta let them decide that. I gotta what? You gotta let them decide it. Yo, yo, no. Blue burbs. I thought we were cool, burb. Secret burb. I thought we were cool, man. I'm just trying to get with Big Bird Boy. It's if you think all I'm burbs missing will out die. on free trade, burbs will never die. Burb. burb forever. forever. <laughs> Burped up galactic hierarchy. I want to join the Northern Burb Alliance. Ask who. How is that going to do Who are you? Uh, Burb Scientist. Why yeah, does, man. Yeah, just ask. Why does someone across the galaxy okay. claim one of my. Not across the galaxy. Is it AI? I bet it's no, AI. It's, it's not across the galaxy, but they're not connected to me. So Silas B is lagging out to me? Oh. Yes. He's like, uh, Burb Scientist, I cannot currently invite you to the faction as soon as I can. Alright. Thanks. That slides me harder, Daddy. Got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven planets in his little area, including one relic world. Whoa. <sighs> wow. Yeah, I've yet to colonize them all. <laughs> that is not okay. Uh, they rip. have no systems. Uh, really press F for Silas. If <laughs> Oh shit, someone, someone got a lot kick? Yep. Oh, F. Oh. Rip Silas. <gasps> Rest in pepperonis. F in the chat oh. for Silas. Potato PT. Potato PT. <laughs> in the purge. I guess that's what the PT uh, stood for in Silas' name. Potato. Where was Silas? No, next Close. to the no, no federation. Oh, I guess it's free real estate now. <laughs> it is. It, it will be free real estate in uh, approximately four years. I'm hoping not. Oh. Whether or not you survive is uh, is up to luck. If you survive, you you may be able to uh, rejoin in the next week's session. I should survive. He just went from re to me to superior. use proper proper language. And again, I'm use re yeah. I was just about to actually do do the nothing, but I guess it's going to be fine. I don't think we will get out that long uh, in this game with this pace. Do, do, do. Uh, let's see if we can invite uh, more burbs into the Great Federation. Uh, we still have to wait. King Burrup. Burbed of the Galactic Hierarchy. Alright, looks like uh, the first Galactic Empire is asking to join. Excellent. Let's grant them that. Uh, Burbador State, please vote yes on the proposition. Hey, uh, Bird Box, Imperium, you here?
Oof. Apparently not. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't look like it. Looks like there's a lot of people in uh, DiploFed 1. I'll go uh, check in with them, see what they're up to. I was telling him. I What's up, guys? Safe. Oh, he literally oh, hit me. Ah, Hello. what are you talking about, me? It's our yes. Lord and Savior. Oh, man. God, okay. What the fuck? Do you have like ES in the Discord or something? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> we were literally just talking about inviting you in. Stefan. I, I have ESP. Uh, that That is what's going on. I have wow. Discord hacks. We, four <laughs> years from now, you know, when the peace is over, we were thinking about asserting you as the biggest uh, galactic, uh, you know, leader. But to ah. do that, we have to get rid of the other galactic leaders, one of which would be Lori. And we surround Lori. We okay. have him surrounded. <laughs> Where is Lori on the map? Move. At the bottom. All you Heads have up. to do is we, say we the We got you surrounded. Oh my god. <laughs> he, is sur <laughs> he is surrounded. We just wanted to make sure it's okay with you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Stefan, did you what? read uh, what I sent you on the game? Uh, I did not. I very we rarely read chat. We have a problem. Uh, tell me the problem. We have a big problem, comrade. About to double this pop with me. Who? I don't. I don't know what's going on. You see my neighbor, uh, comrade. Who are you? Okay, first of all, where is your empire? It's right next to you, like a bit, a bit uh, to the top uh, left. Complete. Top uh, left. Yeah, I see you. All right. So, so DC, what are you I, saying? I, uh, my computer doesn't have a search. And you see the other empire that is neighboring me, the exact uh, thingy. Uh, the one in the south, or what? No, the exact carte, the gray one to my left. Ah, this I guy see is, that. He, This guy is a big boy triarder, right? A big boy triarder, really? And with my meme, uh, with a meme uh, build, is probably going to wipe me out. All right. So right now I'm doing my defenses, but just to let you know, if this guy somehow get double of his pops so easily, it's going to be a mess later on for right. everyone involved. I shall. Well, I will consider myself warned. Yeah. All, All right, right, guys. By the way, sorry for the DC. I bought a. Communications. Yeah. Uh, by the way, this is what the south, uh, burb. Uh, yeah, southwest yes. one. So, yeah, southwest. southwest. We're just called Burb Union. Yeah, you should call yourself uh, the South Burbs. Is that? See, this is should... what I was saying. Yes, we should have a <laughs> North Burbs. Uh, I am leading the East Burbs, and you should be the South Burbs. Oh, uh, guys, it's official. The, the meme build has now top economy in our union. Let's go. The meme <laughs> build. Nice. Oh yeah, boys. <laughs> What build are you running? Uh, let me check uh, your empire. Alright. Uh, can I get a burb? I see you're running conversion guilds, mining guilds. Alright. That, that's looking like a good empire build, I have to say. Oh. I picked randomly. I normally do inward perfectionist geckos. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so. not, uh... So I was really just taking a chance here. I was like, well, these look okay. <laughs> and I, I mean, they are some of the best uh, civics in the game right now, so. I he chose swear wisely. Ragunas got kicked earlier. Yeah, he did. He did. Wait. Ragunas got kicked and then he no, managed to no. rejoin? What? Uh, Ryan Killer. Uh, I think your mic is. You're hot. Ooh, guys, right now, uh, Big Burb. Oh yeah, by the way, you're you're hot miking, but it's possible to still rejoin next week, right? Because my computer, I had a power surge for a second, and my computer didn't have a surge detector, so I DC'd. Oof, oof, dude, that is rough. Yeah, yeah, it is possible for you to join next week and uh, sub right. in as one of the umpires. Of course, I'll the people who are here this week will have priority, but you'll be at the top of the list for reconnecting. All right. All right. Thank you. See you next week. See you next Excuse week. Excuse me. Federation members, uh, my time of dying to my left, he wants association status. Are we giving it to him? He is a non bird he No, is a no. Oh, no, 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 no. We do not deal with non burbs in any way whatsoever. <laughs> nope, no politics with them. No politics with the non burbs okay, I'll, I'll decline to him. 
Yes. Oh yeah, guys. Uh, you know what I don't get? What, what is like the likelihood of going uh, Gaia World start and then getting like a Gaia World right next to you? Like, so, like I, dude, I the chances are super low. Guys, but... on the players that we have not seen, Artinix, he is a he is a try hard. That man, that man has I've seen him wipe out some empires like mm. early game. I expect he's going to attack the instant pieces over. Artinix. Instant. Where is Artinix? It's same for Comrade. So it's going to be bad. Oh, oh, comrade. I okay. wanted to kill the game. So are we going to be attacking Lori or not? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe uh, not right, or right away, but maybe pretty soon after peace. Yeah, don't, don't attack him right away. Make him think yeah. that he's safe. And then strike. Wait a couple yeah, <laughs> maybe at 2025. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, then we'll take out Singularity first. Like, th think, think about go. this. Yeah, think about this. Like, uh... Lori has Moskovsky as his capital name. That that's that's basically like Moscow right there, and that means that he is uh <laughs> he he's emulating people that we want to purge, you know. We want to purge. But the problem is he's on a continental world, so occasionally there is winter. Oh god, that's true. Dang that is a very good point. You will have to plan very carefully. <laughs> Can only fight during the summer. Yeah, you got to make sure to declare war in the in the spring <laughs> to uh, <laughs> to finish it up by winter. Actually, you want to avoid the spring due to the fact that that's kind of the mud season. Oh yeah. Mm. Okay. The problem is the problem is you know if you attack during the spring, there's mud. If you attack during the summer, there's not enough time, right? There's burn. Yeah, yeah. I think we should just get a colossus and deal with him like that. Should I send him <laughs> yeah, twenty years in, twenty years. Should in. I send him the planet cracker I found just lying around? Not even put boots on the ground. That's that's not for me. No boots on the ground. I don't want to yeah. touch such soil. <sighs> Honestly, it is tainted soil. I mean, ultimately, all you have to do is uh, is siege his planets. You 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 shouldn't. Uh, Blow it up. Yeah. Okay. You should uh, bombard them from far. You know, try to starve them out, but don't try to invade and actually occupy the cities because that doesn't work. We know whoa, that. Whoa, 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 Ryan! I thought you gave him me Galpan. You're, you're, uh, you're next time, can we do a migration treaty, please? <laughs> also, I'm a very uh, happy Megacorp right now. Ryan, you're taking Galpan. I thought you were giving me Galpan. No, he's giving you sexy eyes. Yeah, I have very. I only have one branch office. I just can't get any luck with. Oh no, I was just uh, colonizing other places. I only have three construction ships, and I had a lot of uh, mining outposts to make. Yeah, yeah, I actually have my science ship on the way to finish the survey. Alright, anyways, I'm gonna hop back into the, the regular chat, and uh, I'll be talking to you guys later. Maybe when the goes down. You know, take some land. You've got planets right next to my border. It's really tempting. Which one are you? I'm the benevolent empire. I'm gonna try to eat this AI next to me, the Lord Keepers, because they're getting kind of crazy with their fleet size. So, I think they're a danger to everyone. Oh God! But then, if you eat them, you will become the danger to everyone. Think about they're, that. They're just a robot. They're just. They're, oh, in that they case, yeah. Pur robot purge the flesh, toaster. They're a robot in mind. Purge the toaster. Exactly. Hey, it's Amazon. Yes, friend. It it warms my heart to look around me and know that I as Lithoids have more pops than some orchid. <laughs> oh boy. You tell him. You you tell him. And we're perfectionists, no migration treaties. So yes, you are being out popped by Lithoids. <laughs> out popped by Lithoids, that's an oof right there if I have ever seen one. God. Alright, let's see. Uh, East Burbs, if you could send me some energy credits, I can establish uh, two more branch offices on uh, the secret Burb and Burbed Up Galactic Hierarchy so we can unite in spiritualism. How much, uh... Okay, so I got 2k already. I need like uh, another thousand or so. Alright. Never mind, I'm broke. <laughs> 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 
Alright, I'll be able to establish uh, one branch office now. I'll spread the word of the burb. And then uh, I'll have to establish one later. I'm not producing uh, too many resources right now because, of course, I'm building temples of prosperity. Uh, worshipping the burb comes before making profit. I like it, I like it. Further spreads the word of the burb. By the yeah. way, anyway, this is extremely important. Um, who needs help? Who needs three help? three years, war is coming. Oh god, right? Oh shit. We have to Oof. post the chat if we're declaring war. I'm sorry no, about that. No, there is no in-game declarations. You can just attack after you put your claims. Yeah. Uh, I guess we should start building up our fleet then. Pretty much everyone. That's a bit late for that. A bit late. <laughs> For I mean, a bit of context, right now I may already be dead, so that's nice. Alright, give me comms, I wanna see. Complete. Ask them. Yeah, I'll, I'll ask them. That's funny. Mom might say that. Right, I'm gonna ask comms from uh, Comrade Truck as well. Hopefully he gives them to me. That way I can spectate, but you guys will be still kept in the dark. Um, we should probably get some no, he doesn't. Border he doesn't agree. He's no friend of the burb. You guys, you guys could possibly support me because right now I'm kind of the front line. Where are you, Ragunas? Who? Who's talking? We're cracking. We're about side. Coop, nah. I'm uh, next to Comrade and probably next to you, but I don't see you. Oh yeah, you're like just below me. Oh my. Um, we are we are just uh, under the AI. How do you open chat again? I never do. In game chat, there's a small button in the bottom right that's like two arrows. Click on that, and then there'll be a multiplayer chat. Yeah, I have to mention. Uh, to the audience, this is an incredible game design. So, in the bottom right, we have an empty space and a button that's basically more. And there's only two buttons. So, they could have, of course, just put the two buttons on the menu and done away with the more button, but they didn't. You know, they had to hide the chat from the, the kids spamming the chat. So, you just hit them behind a button, in case you guys aren't aware. Air up. Air up. Overlooking the fact that the chat button used to be in that empty space. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, they so updated it. they updated it to, to make it like this. So it is clearly an intentional change. Evolution. Evolution, indeed. I'm sorry, here in the Church of Bird, we don't believe in evolution. Burb was made <laughs> by Burb. You believe in flat earth and theory, like First, there was burb, only like burb. Flat burb theory. <laughs> flat burb theory. <laughs> <laughs> was that that flat reminds me of a video with a horse. A horse, really? <laughs> I can't do that, but... I see the uh, similarity. <laughs> I mean, excuse my language. Uh, yes. Ah. Uh, I said flapjacks. Um, would it be okay if I sent you a uh, heretical video to explain the horse thing? Yet. Uh, you can send it in DMs, but not send it publicly, please. And you do not need to declare it in chat. Yeah. Oh, yes. Laura, you don't have to... Oh. oh and Lori is declaring in chat, uh, yeah. and he's going to go to war soon. But that's something that is disregarded for this game. You do not need to... Yeah, you don't need to do it. But you just must wait till you're 20. Mm-hmm. You must wait patiently. I'm on the front line with the anti-bird federation. Listen, I'm trying to negotiate. I'm not saying I will go to war. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to negotiate. Ooh, so you are threatening. Yes. So threats are your tactic of negotiations, I see. Ooh, I'm surrounded by enemies. Do you see where I am from the map? I'm alone. <laughs> see, I'm surrounded. Here is the deal we have for you. Do okay. nothing. That oh. is the deal. Oh. Sounds like a good deal. You might survive if you do nothing, but if you do something. Well, mm. There's not a single nation within the Southwest Burb Union that is 
superior or even equivalent to me. So I, I am prepared. <laughs> All right. All direct if I need to. Uh, Lori, I'm just saying your mic is uh is, is, is a two dollar CSGO mic. I, I couldn't hear someone speaking. Was someone talking? My old one uh broke. Oh no. Rip. You can get like you can get like two dollar headphones that you have to put the mic up to your face to speak with, right? Like those those wired headphones for phones, and it would have a better mic. <laughs> <laughs> Look, he's not wrong. Ouch. I just need to buy a table. I lost. Anyway, what was I saying again? Okay, yes. Who needed help next? I've already sent three orders out. I reckon needs help. Albania opened their borders to me. Good. Next shipment is ready. Wait, you're providing alloys for no cost? Yeah. I wouldn't I do like that. those, please. Why do you think no, I'm here? I would like some. I can tell you. Technocracy of Zoom wishes to partake in trade. I don't. If he's not a bird, don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're already fedding up. Like roaches. Roaches? We're fedding Ooh, up like, uh. Hurt. Like respectable and, uh. You know, intelligent beings. Look, well. Although roaches might not be pretty, you never order. Really get rid of Taken. I mean, granted, roaches do survive a nuclear war, but there's no nuclear war here, at least not of yet. Unless you can crack a planet, we would still survive. Yeah, but the planet of cracking has not yet already begun. Oh god, I just got confused by the, the feedback. Someone, someone has echo. Not me again. Echo, Roger Tango. How do you even have ro Echo on push to talk? I don't know. They're like, holding the push to talk button. It must be. Who is it? Yeah, we're good. He sets a rock on the control it's button. It's probably me because I'm using the shift button a lot for obvious reasons. Because I'm about to die. Oh. <laughs> Gunas, what is your, your fleet like? Uh... Oh. Oh, never mind. It's his. Ah, I see why you're struggling because your fleet is not existent yet. Oh, I know what you're doing. You evil, I'm not the only evil one psychopath. Don't, don't worry, don't worry. I'm not okay, the only okay. one. Oh, you're Can not the, the only one doing it. Oh my. Okay, for for the next session, we're gonna have to make sure that people are on the same page on that. Um, I'm not gonna reveal it on stream, but I'm sure most of you guys realize what I'm talking about. If you've played with Ragunas, you know what we're talking about. Yes. He's a very scary man. Yeah, but that's scary enough, it would seem. Yeah. It, it's one of those things that tryhards do. I'll just put it that way. No, it's not min max, it's tryharding. Oh. That is the sort of thing that Ragunas is uh, doing, and he's assuming other people are doing. Why can't I invite the Burr Plantation to the, the they are. Federation? I thought that's uh, someone is voting, uh, voting them down. I don't know. Wait, Burp Plantation. Sir, who is voting Who is no? voting against him? Why? Why are you voting against me? What have I done? We need to make a West Burb Federation. There should be a West Burb Federation. I don't think there is. Uh, by the way, everyone in the East East Burbs Federation should uh, assign an envoy to the Fed. Hey, guys. At least one. The Galactic oh, okay. Market is about to pass. Oh, yes. Nice. Oh, finally. Finally. Uh, we need to put that thing down. Come on, guys. Let's download it. Guys, let's all switch to opponents. Ah, okay, so I figured it out. Uh, it's burbed up galactic hierarchy. You know why? Because the dude disconnected. Oh. Uh, well, well, guess who's getting vote kicked. Yep. Alright, now we'll be so able to me, invite... Wait. Thank you guys. Yes. We figured out the problem. There we go. Nice. Thank you guys. If anybody um, finds anyone that went banned, banned origin, let us know. Alright. 
could we maybe... It's a bit late for that. Orders with the no, actually, it's good as for now because two people got kicked at the start because somebody had went to band. Actually, I'll just do quick crowds. Yeah. Cause, Quickly cause see. If we do end up at war with the uh, anti-bird alliance, I'm kind of need your guys' help. Yeah, man. Huh? If someone started with like a band origin, then there would be AI or a fallen empire, right? Ah, uh, well, it's either that or there are other band origins such as Shattered Ring and uh, Void Dwellers. But does that remove people? Because that doesn't add AI. Uh, that one could remo potentially people. remove people. Yeah, but I think we had... We had two. Ooh, we had two observers, right? Yeah. Uh, so, it might have just been right. a space thing. No, I I'm, think, uh, I, I'm suspecting it. some someone started with uh, with one of the band starts that spawned AI. That's evil. Yeah, but do we have any spawned AI? Well, we have some AI. Uh, let me check the empires real quick. Because oh, as far as I can tell, everyone's a player unless it was a disconnect. How people. about we just... Uh, Steph, no, I've already just started looking through the logs. You're going to be going for a while. All just, right. Just enjoy, just enjoy uh, the game and have fun. And If someone meets an empire that is, uh, again, cheating or whatnot, then we can remove them from the game and get back to... So wait, no worries. Wonderful, wonderful. When you nominate your world for a Galactic Hub uh, thing, or uh, Galactic Market, and it doesn't even have any trade value. I'm gonna nominate oh, my right. world. Let's see. Strong competitiveness. Nice. Now, the only problem is, whenever I nominate a planet and it's uh, strong, it never gets passed. Even with like, four empires in the whole galaxy. So, rip the Galactic Market for me. I remember someone wasn't even in the galactic community. Oh yeah. And they had, and they had weak, uh, what was it? They had weak like competitiveness, and they still got it. Dude, I remember a time uh, that was even more egregious. Uh, one time, the galactic market was founded on a planet that wasn't even nominated. Like that's how bad it can be because uh, each planet has like a base chance of getting nominated. I'm assuming it's there, you know, just in case no one nominates the market and someone has to take it. So they added like some very, very small base chance, and that very, very small base chance happened. And some machine empire, which, which did not even nominate their planet, <laughs> suddenly became the market leader. There's also the, the care. Some, I got the, the care from, uh, from the relic, uh, the relic uh, world uh, archaeology, archaeology site. Is everyone and having fun exploring their inner autism? Yeah, Absolutely. No, I'm not actually. Uh, is anybody else streaming right now? Mm -hmm. I'll I... stream for you if you want. Oh, Hell well, yeah. Only if you can handle it. Just a... Stream auto. Yeah, this is. I mean, this this 72 person event is uh, is just a community event. I organized it with two other Discord servers. Uh, not with other content creators, but I mean, potentially we can organize another one with content creators. Uh, I'm sure some of them, well, I'm sure a lot of them will be on board and uh, getting into a 72 person game. Yeah, you proved that it works, so I think yeah. you'll get have some takers. On normal speed. Yeah, on normal speed. I mean, normal speed is, is good enough, and I'm sure with content creators, you know, there'll be a lot of diplomacy going on more than there will be with normal people you know yeah. stuff coordinating everybody into the same time zone Otto that's a cute tech number rip the benevolent empire Lori no Lori no what is it was you're so, allowed? You were finally getting positive XP. Hey Otto, was Dooms allowed? Well, no. 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 Oh, no. Oh, it could be that some people were banned due to uh, oh, wait. Doomsday. Okay. Laurie, the Southwest Burb Union wishes to negotiate in uh, Fed Room 1. 
Okay. Uh, Lori, real quick, can you give me comms uh, for your empire? I just want to show the audience uh, what's going on approximately. Did I? I didn't yeah, you you rejected. Oh, did I? Okay, send it again. Yeah, I sent it. Is that good? Ram Federation. Yeah, that's good. All right. Perfect. Yeah. Look at Leonardo, fucking freaking macroing his uh his scientists. You know what I'm saying? Who, who's micro macroing? Otto's microing his scientists. Wait, where's Otto? I want to see this. Uh, Otto, can you give me I'm cards? Streaming. I want to. Wait, wait, you went like active sensor link? Yeah. I want to see how you're uh, macro microing your scientists. You can't really see that part. All you can see is how his technology number is higher than yours. All right. I don't know if I join the stream. Something okay. I, I'm not gonna join the stream because something bad can happen potentially. Be a protector. <laughs> yeah, we gotta be a protector. Nah, man. I don't feel like it. Hey, it's re you can learn a lot by watching auto play on normal speed. Hmm. Receiving communications. Right, what is this? You're demanding alloys for me? Never. I could I could teach you, but I'd have to charge. Nah. Alien Federation formed. The burb does not pay. Are you a materialist, daughter? Technology uh -oh. secured. That's interesting. Otto, your build is strong practically rather than idealistically. I don't mean to brag, but uh, guess who just got blue lasers? Oh! No, oh I still haven't even gotten them. I mean, I'm on my way to destroyers. Ooh, nice. Actually, only two months left. Who wants to be free? My uh, oh. protectorate. Why? You, you still have so much to learn. <laughs> I is, want is to be free. Is integration allowed? Uh, no. Uh. I want to be free. But I'm going to die, so it won't matter. I wanna I wanna see this once this happens. Ragunas, you absolutely must shout at me when something happens. Uh, also, uh, there's still a hope, Raguna. There's still there, there is still a hope. Uh, East Burbs, if you have any extra energy credits, I need to settle a planet with the trade. Let's go. No, we gotta hey, we, we gotta welcome the Burb plantation into the fold. So I need to make I sure the word of the yeah, Burb is spread there. Power. Hey, Otto, show, me, show me your situation, like Otto. He has 56 feet power. No, you, don't, you didn't do it. Wait, Wait Stefan, you need some energy credits, right? Yeah, I need some energy credits. I need to welcome the bird plantation. Mm, mm, mm. Is that a bird warrior here? Okay, Since we're losing energy. XP, but I see plus 0.8 in our fed. Our XP is not good in Alpha. I have to send eventually my people to bed. Yeah, by the way, East Burb Federation. You gotta assign more envoys. At least assign I, one. I'm assigning I my only one. two. I have assigned one. Alright. We need to make sure this uh, Federation is cohesive and is earning more trade as we level up. Communications. <laughs> has anybody looked at the system names of the first Galactic Empire? Oh, oh yeah, my god! <laughs> it, it, is, it is literally just Star Wars memes. Huh. Have you ever heard of the strategy of Darth Plagueis the Wise? It's a story the Jedi would never tell you. Wait, who, has, who just got blue lasers? I mean, I've had those for a while. Yeah, this guy has I all tier 3 everything. Lasers. I've had blue lasers for a while. What? All yeah, tier? I still don't have all tier 3 everything? How do you do that? 
Pretty yeah, much. it's possible, but it's gotta be good to do. at the game. Rushing uh, anomaly. Rushing anomalies, I guess. I have um, blue lasers, tier three power, and nothing else upgraded. That's the real strat. That is the real strat. The real strat is to just beeline straight for jump track. Beeline for jump drives. Beeline for the, the, the true true strat is to beeline for mega structures, and uh, yeah. get a ring roll before anyone else because of course ring rolls are powerful. Mm. That's how it works. Especially in a game like this when we all have so little space. And the end game gets here in what fifty years? <laughs> I mean. Yeah. Yeah, Endgame, oh, no, like Endgame will begin in like 50-something years, but the Endgame Crisis will only arrive after 23-25. I think we're all gonna die. <laughs> What's new? What's new? What is this Federation taxes on my solar panel network? Ah, yes, there's all- ah, I forgot about that, but... Uh, the Federation gives the 10% tax, I believe, on your energy production. Most of the time you don't notice it because it's applied as an Empire modifier, but it is one of the few things that is applied to things like Dyson Spheres and Solar Panels. So you do get a, a, a bit of a tax for being in a Federation, but it's not too bad. The game has been going on for 2 hours and 15 minutes. Congratulations. Congratulations, the game still has not crashed. It is quite stable. We have crack and lagging now. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. As you say that, you, you should never say things like that, Chris. Never jinx. Uh, I, did, I, I just said how long we went into the game. You're the one who said. <laughs> the you ah, the that's true, that's true. Go. I'm at fault. I'm at fault. I'm sorry. Ah, I take the blame. It is all my fault. Where does the word? Crack and say internet's becoming a. Oh no. I don't know why. We're cracking new. It's so slow, what's happening? I don't know what's happening. Well, the, ga the game is slowing down right before, you know, we hit the the big boy year in 2220. Uh -oh. I I'm willing to bet that the moment we hit year 2220, there's gonna be like five different war decks. You're going to war, except more than one. Oh my god, am I facing a purge here? Oh, uh, no. the game is paused. Everyone stop. Now it's not. It's not paused for me. It's not paused, and Kraken is still in. Wow. Oh my god. <laughs> Kraken may want to sit in the system for a minute, just let the stuff kind of catch up. Oh god, I, I see Ragunas over there. Well, in case I get kicked, I might as well tell people. I was planning to put in a, a positive envoy in Ragunas and invite him to our fed just to see if that'll save him. Mm. Uh. He, he is a non-burb, so we, we are not allowed to do diplomacy with him. As a non-burb, uh. you know, he could not be one of us. There's as much as I can do to try and save you, Raguna. Am I really lagging this out? Yep. Oh, Christ. You're at your third ping. I'm sitting five. Oh, no. Five strikes and you're out. Spaceball. <laughs> Let's start. <laughs> Spaceball. Kraken, don't do this. <laughs> don't, don't strike out on us, man. No. There's nothing to manage in my empire. I've not even moved my mouse in ages. It's probably not your empire. Is someone watching YouTube? Go. Someone. No. Someone's watching Netflix. Dude, I, I bet someone in, in your household is uh, streaming 4K. <laughs> someone's streaming the game. You know, someone's stream maybe someone is streaming the game within your very own household. Who knows? In that case, if they are streaming the game in your household, I will tell them directly. Please, for the love of Kraken, halt. Uh, 
right, we're almost at year 2220. Oh no, no. Oh no. A very, I'm gonna get a lot of war deck this is gonna be a very tense year. Come on, countdown. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh god, oh god. Oh god, oh clench, god. Clench. Oh, oh rip. Moment that we're finished that. Yeah, well, oh god. Oh, yeah. god. Yeah. oh no. Wait, oh, comes. wait. Pause. Guys, don't pause oh, it, Don't pause wait, again. Comrade declared on Ragunas. Wait, what? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes, Comrade Ragunas has been scared of this. It's a dangerous complete. player on our server. Comrade is a, is a very sweaty mimaxer, so he, he wanted to challenge Ragunas. <laughs> How are you doing? I have same amount of fit power actually. I told you that there's 15 oh, maybe really not. dangerous players in the game. Be careful. My time of dying. Um, but isn't Ragunas also one of those dangerous players? He was. I, I mean, is somewhat I, still. Ragunas is a dangerous player. <laughs> but I'm memeing. <laughs> Personally, I hope they just kind of stalemate since I'm uh, right next to them. Oh god. You'll be next. War declared. Oh god, the galaxy is, is breaking the, out into warfare. The death fleets are coming. Death fleets. We need help. You know who to ask. Stick them in my hand, waving in the wild. Well, at least none of the super feds have gone to war yet. We are the guardians of the west, and we will protect yes. the galaxy. Oh, look at all the wars starting. There is uh, strength in numbers. Not really. Well, for now. But now it seems only yeah. the the, hey, the uh, lone wolves have been attacked. Barbaria, can you come to uh, Fed One? The problem is, is that if the once you allow the people who declared war to meet up, they're gonna have numbers. What's going oh, on? Oh no, that's not good. The South is stay scared. Yes, I bought you free. That's that's actually huge. Man, that's going quickly, like, they're dying out there. Okay, so I, I know there's a war going on in Ragunza space. Uh, who else is at, is at war? Okay, it looks like some AI is at war. Uh, my time of dying is at war. My time of dying? Interesting. I'm gonna go check out what's going on over there. My time of dying versus Rabonia. Bonia, give me comms. Uh, same with uh, that's a girl, girl strike there at her day. However, that however you pronounce that, girl strike, pronounce your name. All right, whatever. Looks like uh, no mic. No worries. Let's we see how this it. game is going on. We'll oh. hold the peace. Alright, looks the like uh game is politics. The whole game is politics from this point onwards, and uh, politics aren't looking pretty for Burbonia. Burboria, Burbonia. Really. Burboria, yeah. Burboria, here, I'll make a deal. I'll buy your lands for cheap and let you people oh, escape declare. to the quadrant that has one energy. <laughs> deal? I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Let's see what the dip- oh god, they will be completely annexed by this war. Yeah, it's the fruits of my- Uh, Lari, if you could uh, hop back in, we've deliberated a bit. Ooh, can, can I join in? I just want to hear uh, what's going on. Sure. The fruits. Alright, I'll, I'll just Lari be here for- friend? No, no, it's, it's Stefan. I'm here for just listening in to the negotiations. Oh, there have been a lot of uh, war yeah. chat that's been going. Yeah, don't worry about me. I'll just uh, chill here. <laughs> yeah. We're, we're war monkey. So, yes. Okay. So, guys. Oh, wait. What happened with Baboria? What happened with Baboria? I think Baboria just lost. Yeah, Baboria, Baboria is pretty much lost. dead. Yeah, they don't they, have much. They need to No, they're support. still at war. Yeah, no, but they Baboria don't just lost anymore. 2k. They just lost their 2k and the spaceport. The Baboria's yeah, they down. Yeah, they don't got anything. The, the best we can do is just in turn to clear war need on to Dos, take... Dos Okay, the Zeodex, the Zeodex is a bird. We need to give Zeodex... We need to invite him to the Federation. Who? 
Zodex. He's the one that borders Agoria. I uh, keep in mind there's He's a ten. To... There's a ten person cap. Oh, there is shit. Yeah. We'll give him associate status, guys. But he's going to be the next target, all right? It's going to be Bavoria, and then it's definitely going to be Zeodex. Hi. Hello. Um, oh, oh, guys, I have views. Looks like Kalori has Lori arrived. Okay. The German fleet's Lori. number in 2.4K. That's their strength. We're so, going to negotiate uh, just friendly peace between your federation and ours. For the meantime. I yeah. mean, like, all treaties are technically for the, you know, until we up to it. <laughs> we have other um, focuses. We're just looking at it, and there is a threat to really both of our, us in the uh, the West. Um, I, I can't say it's the German name. Um, in like the... It, it's Das Grosreich. Grosreich. Um, I, thank you. Um... And uh, yeah, they have some pretty good tech, and they're pretty strong. So it uh, it's kind of they're the the bigger fish in the pond right now. So what they propose? We just want to have it like peace for now between our federation, non-aggression, um, and friendly terms, basically. Although if you if you helped us wipe them out, we could. Perhaps talk uh, about they're like on peace. the other side of us. Yeah, they can't reach him, so it's, they can't really help. So it's not That's like that's fine. Mm, you're right. You're right. You're right. Hmm. Okay. So I, mean, I have tier two on some of my tags. I'm looking at the war. Path. I have tier three, so we should be able to make federations corvettes with tier three. Oh yeah, yeah. We just need to unlock that in the federation. We'll have to change that. All right. Uh, I'll be hopping out of here. It looks like there is peace between your two federations. Uh, Rigurdus has just fought yeah. off his attacker. Well, it's, uh, somebody. Rigurdus has fought off his attacker. Yeah. Not for long, right? Not for long, but that was very impressive. I I saw that, dude. That was a very good strategy. Like you, you deployed guys... your fleets forward instead of waiting for him to come at your station. Was that intentional? Yeah. Because if he had seen I had so much shield, he would have probably considered backing up. Hmm. I see. So. So you didn't want him to back off. You wanted to engage him right here, right now, because you had the advantage. So you pressed the advantage. Yeah. Is that what happened? Nice. This is this is a war strategist uh, at play right here. And mostly because I'm desperate as well. <laughs> Many good strategies going down. Oh yeah, you have oh my god, you have pure shields on your corvettes. Yeah, I yeah, see. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't mind supporting one of the two to keep it in a stalemate. It's a unique strategy. It is a very interesting strategy that's uh, is going on right here. Alex DeVries is saying, Ragunas lives, be afraid. Very afraid. I think we should be afraid of Ragunas uh, for surviving, but at the same time, now, it is a relief that someone we don't know uh, was going to dominate the galaxy. Like, they were going to dominate the galaxy, but I'd rather have Ragunas dominate the galaxy. Because we can deal with a backstabbing freshman, right? We don't know how to deal with Comrade. How do you deal with a Comrade? He's a Comrade. Once again, once again, Paradox, please add McCarthyism. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. Uh, add Conrad as an official empire confirmed. So you're saying Conrad's losing, but Conrad's in his system. Conrad is in his system, but the 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 big battle of the war happened, and uh, the death stacks collided, and uh, Ragoons' death stack won. For how long? For how long? Uh -huh. We have no clue. For and not long. We have no clue what Ragoons is gonna do with his death stack. But we shall yeah. wait and see. He's fighting comrades, so it's not going to be easy. It's not going to be easy. Ragoon is, is not going to just be able to waltz in and uh, take the space. Ragoon will have to meticulously plan and scheme to uh, to defeat comrade. It's really a ba battle of a trick. It really is. Once you re once you get to 
point where you both have a, around the same amount of fleet power, it's either either you have one option, you would just hope for the best and hit them, or you just keep continue building until you think you have a good enough advantage. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and if you if you build for long enough, the war will time out. So yeah, that's a possibility. This can all be resolved in a peaceful manner. I hope. It, I hope. Mm, I I hope someone wins. Now, I hope no one wins this. Uh, it'll be it'll be best if both of them stayed in a stalemate and uh, none of them became really scary boys. Oh god, what is this? One of, one of them winning is advantageous for me. Zone Empire. Uh, so Zone Empire just declared war against... First Galactic Empire, yes. The entirety of the East Burbs Alliance. Okay. Interesting. Kill him. Kill him I can't actually get there because Lollington won't open his borders. The thing is, with big federations like that, it's gonna be hard Everybody to like go. coordinate your fleets. Yes. He has two one more war. Power. So yeah, if you micro if you micro I don't even think I can well, get there as well. You might be able to kill your fleet. Right. Just yeah, and it looks like he's built stations in almost every system. Now right, let's see which one of our fellow Federation burbs has uh, the fattest fleet. I will send them more alloys. Um, I can't get to the war. Wait, burb plantation? You can't get to the war? Oh yeah, no, I can, tempest. but it will be uh, it will also, be as well. the Croatian Croatians have made claims upon me. Where is the Croatians. Down? What is this? Hearts of Iron Four? He's in. The, he's in the north. He's like Chris. Bob Jones is like northeast. Right on Galactic Rim. I mean, uh, at Galactic Center. Technology secure. Galactic Center. Are you talking about the Croatians? Yes, the Croatian Directorate. Hmm. I'm looking all around the thing, but I can't see it. No. They're directly below me, and directly above the First Galactic Empire. War declared. Oh, they've declared war. Ah, I see it. And yeah. this... This is, a, this is an interesting development. Okay. Big war time. So it looks like uh, the fact that the capitalistic system of these burbs is being exploited and uh, we are getting attacked. We only wanted to trade. That's all we wanted. Um, zone club, would it be possible to negotiate peace? Uh, who's asking? Well, the people you're killing. Hey, well, say your name when you're speaking. Palps. Palps, alright. First Empire. First Empire, what do you want? Uh, I would surrender and become a vassal if you let me keep my systems. Oh, I have a few- oh no. Oh, I see what was going on. Zone Empire is, is another one of the- of the people that Chris was talking about. One of those sweaty tryhards from uh, no, Legends not, United. Or is he not? He's not actually, a, uh, he's good, but he's not actually in the tier of the ones I was referring to. Hmm, interesting. But he does have a 2.5k fleet, meaning that he spent his entire early game building up this fleet. He does have a good army, yes. Mm hmm Or he has good friends in high places. Oh no. I'd like to have some good friends as well. Some people should be connected to a United Legend, but I don't know. I don't know. Um... <laughs> For the East Burb states that can't participate in the war, could you contribute alloys? Uh, to whom? Uh, well, I'm directly affected in this war with uh, the Croatian Science Directorate and the First Galactic Empire. Who are, are, are you? Are you Tempest? Lines. Who are you? I, I, Tempest. I, Tempest, okay. What? 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 You just got refugees. What is this? Oh no. Oh. What the? What? What? Uh, what? Uh, the First Galactic uh, Empire capitulated? How'd that happen? What? I, I think he's right. What? Ooh. He Ooh. 
I epically misclicked. Ep oh epically misclicked. Oh my god. Not like this. Not like this. Well, at gonna... least we've got open borders with zone for a while. Are you gonna give him uh, his territory back, or what are you gonna do? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that'd be like Bloody give him the territory he was gonna give back. It may look might be a vassal. Oh, uh, yeah. The only problem is we're at war and we can't transfer stuff while at war. God. Uh, reparations uh, should be made, even though. I can't. It's just a mess. I can't get into reparations. Uh, Spiffco has declared war on us. Oh no, we're, oh, we're we getting assailed from all sides. Yeesh. Yes, favor exploit is planned. Hey, yeah, no first, no uh, favor exploiting. Yeah, uh, I'll transfer uh, some uh, territories. Uh, the members of the not pure non verb nations, can you please vote yes on this current We need uh, the one true consciousness. War declared. Thank you. Oh god. NQ, are you here? You didn't do any favor trading, right? Because trading favors with AI is an exploit. Hold yes. on. I'll, I'm gonna need a minute to figure this territory out. Talk to him about it, like form your own chat, like. Uh... Oh hey, first you wanna first Galactic Emperor? Let's move to a different channel. Northern Alliance to Fed Three, please. This is an emergency. Excuse me. What's the <laughs> cause of this like unwanted aggression? Go to, to Federation 4, uh, Galactic Empire, to get your- there you go. Yeah, I'm sure our, our Federation is very well aware that we're in two wars now. Wait, what's going on? Am I at war with someone? The Northern Federation is, uh, at war with our other neighbors. Northern Federation oh, no. is war with a decent amount of people right now. Ah. Uh, Northern Burb Alliance, let's see. Oh, God, I they're, just they're follow my leaders. People. New. I'm sorry, but there's nothing. Rudas, we must make strong fleet to defeat enemy. <laughs> I just really wanted to praise the bird system. There was a level one out, or a level one that you can get for the entire game. Uh, Nurgazel, you need to set your war demands. Alright, I see that the system is getting transferred between the First Galactic Empire and uh, the Zone Empire. Yeah, I think, uh... Guys, asking why we're lagging, yeah. there is a ton of battles going on right now. Oh, so yeah. A lot of entities are colliding, which is a lot of projectiles. And apparently some people have not changed their graphics, as I can see. And it's causing a tight bit of uh, graphic FXX issues. So yeah, I, I see there's one person that is, uh, specifically... Yeah. Got to change the settings. <laughs> I always want to make sure your settings are on low when this many people are going. In. Yeah. Um, Herb Science Guy, my neighbor, would you like to go down Burb. to the three? Hey, it's Burb and I, the Science Guy. No, <laughs> oh, Burb and I, the Science Guy. Burb, that Burb, is, that, Burb, that's Burb. A name. That is like a name. Someone should do that sometime. <laughs> Burb and I, the Science Guy. Burb. Burb, 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 Burb. Nah, the signs burp. Oh god. I... So um I tried to change my graphic settings and now and uh, it was a uh... For the viewers, I am so sorry. I've been paying so much attention to what's going on in, in the galaxy that I've been awfully mismanaging my economy. I you know, bend on my knee and uh and plead for forgiveness. This is this is uh, some awful stuff going on. Uh, it will be resolved shortly. Someone's in a sticky situation. <laughs> right, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, check in on the war going on between the Northern Empires. Are they in another chat? Or are they still here? Oh, uh, we're, we're here. here. You're yeah. here? Alright, so uh, give me comms, uh, both sides, and uh, I'll, I'll check what is going on. I'll send you a few uh, sensor link deals. Oh, hold on. So it looks like one of the wars is over? Is that what happened? For the northern guys, there's two wars going on right now. Northern guys. 
Wait, the northern. Ah, oh, so the northern Burb Alliance is these guys. Two wars. Uh, I'm gonna ask for active sensor and see what's going on. I have did it. I have gotten the atmospheric storms level one and by going to war with the Federation. Also land, but Am I blind or something? I I can see the Northern Burb Alliance in the top like left corner, but where's the rest of them? Oh, there are these guys. Oh no 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 no! So yeah, the, the like pure I see I see what's going on. Uh, the pure non-Burb nations have the same exact Federation color as the North Burb Alliance. Yeah, that's the problem. That is a massive problem. That has been throwing me off. Oh we were first. yeah. I thought we had that many people in our Federation. Yeah no, it's two I different federations. God. I see what's going on. Hmm. Uh, real quick, can everyone involved in the Northern Burb Alliance Wars uh, give me a sensor link? One does not just right. give sensor link for free. Oh my god. No. Hours. No. I will give you uh, a single television set, so ask for one consumer good and I will give it. Alright, fine. All consumer goods are just uh, like household appliances. They're not household appliances, they're, they're television sets, because that is all that people need. Consumer good. Television sets are great propaganda machines, I like it. Yes. The, the populace of all your empires requires a, a propaganda machine. One fresh Mike, propaganda machine every month to be able to survive. It's five hours. No, it's not a single television set. But the AI said that was racist. Or consumer goods from you. What, what really? Out. No. Alright, send them the deal again. Also, there is some stuff going on. For me, it's grayed out. You might right have here. to send the deal. Okay. Montadir Sablisur. Montadir Sablisur. Montadir. Why are people refusing? Oh my god. Bruh, it's for- It's literally for the sake of- um, Okay. For the stream. It's for the sake of the stream. Maybe they're in the other voice chats. Uh, I'll, I'll pop into the other voice chats. Just to make- Just to make it completely clear. War declared. I'm would, literally memeing in this game. Like, th this shared, is not a min-maxing thing. If I shared comps with you, could you see what I see? I don't know. Do it. I, if I, my federation is going to war. You wouldn't see my federation just to see me. Yeah, I think it would just be you and not your other sensor links. Hmm. Yeah. Well, I, I I don't know if you can reach Klondike or Seb because they're having a really good war in the north. I know that. I just literally looked. I just didn't even notice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's a lot of a lot of chaos going on in this galaxy, and I want to uh, get in on this. I prefer to stay on the peaceful end of things, just helping different sidelines, being alloys to friends. Giving you that fresh alloy pizza when you want it. <laughs> yes. I'm on the side of uh, staying in the the far right of the galaxy. Far right of center. And uh, just observing what the other fleshlings are doing. I like that. Fleshling. Yes, the fleshlings. A biological scum. I mean, a <laughs> Yes. Also, okay. So everyone in this chat, please send me a trade deal with an active sensor link. This will not be used against you in any way, shape, or form. Uh, who are you? Uh, I am the Praise Burb Empire. I am on the far right of the galaxy. Alright, I'm gonna hop into Diplo 1 and then, yeah, I'll accept all these sensor links. Uh, you can ask for my sensor link as well. I don't think it shares, like, my sensor, like, all of my sensor links with you guys. So, yeah. I think it should be fine. The most I'll give is a single crystal. Uh, or a single television set. I will not be giving 50 alloys. All right, I'll hop into the other Fed chats. All right, real quick, for the sake of the audience, um, I want an active sensor link from you guys. So can you please send a sensor link to Praise Burb? Uh, yeah. It's in the far right of the galaxy. 
on it. All right, I'll hop into the other chat. Yeah, just keep All it. All right, uh, real quick. Sure. Real quick, I, I need a central link from you guys, uh, just that I can, you know, show the audience what is going on. I will not be using it against you. Please send it to the Praise Burp Empire in the far right of the galaxy. All right. Uh, all right, you guys. So I, I'll be asking you guys the same thing as I was asking the other people. So can you send an active central link to the Praise Burp Empire in the far right of the galaxy? Yep, sure. Thank you. I need to be able to display what's going on. Perfect. Receiving communications. All right, I am back, and um, that seems to have helped. This way, we'll be able to see what is going on. All righty. Now, pretty much the whole map is uh, open to us, and I can see Receiving everything. Communications. Uh, this is the last old I can make, I guess. Oh no! Uh, comrade track. Berboria. Uh, is it? Allowed to give all your resources when you're surrendering? Chris? When you're surrendering? Yeah, Berboria. Yeah, giving your resources to someone else. When yeah, you're about you can to give die. Your resource, yeah, you can give your resources to someone else when you're about to die, but you all can't, right. like, uh, destroy your own stuff. Alright. Then I will accept this. Because Berboria is about to uh, fall. He wanted to give me his stuff. Right. Well, that will definitely boost the economy, at the very least. Death boosts eco. Sad but true. Can anyone in my federation give me like 300 minerals? Who is that? Who's talking? I'm the mangrove flock. Oh yeah, I'm not worried. I can't do that. I mean, I'll accept it. Yeah, I don't think you can trade during war, even if I wanted to. All right, no, I'm gonna you can, you I'm gonna be uh, deafened for a while. So if you if you need to reach me, just uh, ping me. All right. Alrighty. So now we're gonna be doing uh, some galactic coverage of what has been going on with this empire. Well, not this empire. This empire specifically is uh, more off to the side of the galaxy. We're gonna be taking a look at what is going on in the galaxy in general. So this obviously. We have uh, a few attacks going on on the East Burbs Federation, uh, one coming from the north and one coming from the south. Yeah, the one to the north is targeting uh, Tempest specifically, and the one to the south is targeting uh, Nerzagul specifically. Hopefully they don't get to my territory because that would be quite unfortunate and uh, it would impede my role as an observer. Uh, but. Otherwise, uh, let's take a look at what's going on here. So this alliance, this massive 10-player fed, is still at peace. While this uh, less massive... How many players is it? 1, 2, 3, 4. So 5-player fed, they are embroiled in two wars. So one war is against a single enemy, Ayaya DZ the Pro, who seems to be an AI, so that's not that big of a problem. The bigger problem is, of course, the war with the other Federation. They are at war with what seems to be the pure non burb nations. So this whole alliance is at war with this whole other alliance. And considering how borders are really uh, mangled, things are looking a little problematic. Uh, it's also problematic that their colors are basically the same thing as each other's. So this is all a mess of systems getting conquered from each other. I will like, keep an eye on what's going on over here, but for now it's just a complete and utter mess. Now otherwise, there's a little war going on in the south. Looks like uh, Automaton is trying to purge an AI empire, which is uh, completely fine. And uh, it's probably going to make them very, very strong. He's one of the best players uh, in this multi as far as I'm aware. Uh, obviously, the people on the other multiplayer servers are better at multiplayer uh, than those of the Grand Flotilla, but that's also partially my fault for making sure everyone is in, you know, is a burb that is xenophobic and uh, is doing it all for the memes, but whatever. This guy is going to be able to dominate and hopefully he's not going to offend the interests of the burb too much. Now he is offending the interests of this specific burb, but since it's an AI, I will forgive it for now. Otherwise, uh, let's see what's going on. So, 
Of course, yeah, we have this thing going on. Uh, my Federation. My Federation is still at war. It looks like uh, only Nerzigul Burb Praisers and um, Tempest are actually at war. Everyone else seems to be completely fine and fleets are moving around in order to help out with this invasion. That is perfect and yeah, hopefully we're going to be doing well. Now let's see if anyone else is at war. Ha, ah, looks like this guy is in a federation. Federation that consists of him and uh, a few umpires down in the south. This is Lori's federation and the federation that has uh, negotiated a peace with the federation up here. War declared. Oh god, is this another war? Oh yes it is. It's the pure non-Burb nations that have declared war. And the Burb herself is, uh, is chirping. God. This is, uh, this is a little concerning. They're gonna be coming from the north, and they're attacking both... Wow. They're attacking both the northern Burb Alliance and the eastern Burb Alliance. Unless, of course... No, they are still attacking the, the northern Burb Alliance. Looks like, uh, looks like playing with min-maxers was not the best of ideas, but anyways, we will be able to survive this, and we will go through with this whole process. Alrighty, let me unmute myself, and let's talk to the other people. Alright, I'm back. So, Stefan, you're at war. Yeah, I just noticed. Yeah. Oh, we're at war with the entire galaxy. <laughs> Pretty much. Looks like they don't want the the burbs banding together. Science yeah. burbs. I am nothing my personal, Stefan. It's just business. Just business? Oh no. I exist as the front line. How great. <laughs> Wait, are the science burbs here? I'm trying to find them. Yeah, burb scientists, your federation. Impress your presence. Alright, considering how we are at war with three different empires, I think it's time to step up the game. I've been playing, yeah, Rubber Grease. I've been playing relatively, you know, easily and in a relatively chill manner so far. And that has got to change. So we're gonna go ahead and start min maxing our planets. The time has come. I've realized that this galaxy is not as nice as it initially seemed, and so we will. We will have to fight against that, of course. So let's go commission some art pieces, let's fix the amenities problem on our planets. So now, with a good art exhibition across all my planets, everything will be doing good. Obviously, art exhibitions now require some time to set up, so we're gonna do that. Uh, also, looks like we are a bit over Empire Sprawl, uh, but that's not such a big problem. We'll be able to act on this. So what we're going to do is resettle some pops over to other worlds. We have jobs here and let's upgrade these planets. It is much more efficient to resettle pops from your capital planet, even if it does mean sacrificing buildings, in order to get your colonies upgraded. That way your population will grow much faster and it's going to really help us out in making sure our economy can handle all these various wars. Now hopefully we're not doing this too late. Obviously we have a fleet entering Donut enter, uh, which is, of course, not something you're supposed to do if the system is named do not enter, uh, but whatever, I suppose. Might want to start building up this system. Hopefully we don't get attacked and humiliated. That would be a little unfortunate, but at this point, you know, it'll be a little too late, even if that happened. So let's go on. Uh, let's do the same resettlement thing with Avkarshan Prime. Obviously, we have already ruined the building slot over here, a single one, and that leaves some specialists. Let's resettle a single specialist. Of course, there's going to be more specialists when this planet comes into power, and we're going to do the same thing with this planet. We're going to resettle one specialist and one worker and get another capital going. This way, we'll be able to grow our pops much faster on these three colonies, and this colony will slowly develop over time. Uh, now, other than this... 
uh, there isn't really too much we can do. What we can do with our relics that we've gotten is sell them all to private collectors, gain some energy, and with that energy we can potentially purchase... Now, let's not purchase any of that. Let's instead build up some alloy foundries on our planets. And if we want to build up alloy foundries, of course, we're also going to want to build up mineral production. So, let's make this planet and this planet at least my alloy foundries. I was actually not make this one. This should be a science world considering the bonuses to science. Let's make this one and this one. Alloy foundry uh, planets. Let's see, do we have an extra pops anywhere? Anywhere. That doesn't look like it. But whenever a pop grows, we're going to resettle them to Corda Prime and start some robot production on this planet. After all, pops will cause a victory, and a victory, victory will, of course, be desirable. So we're going to do that. Uh, we're pretty much done resettling and doing stuff right here. I suppose we can build a research lab on this planet once we can. We're not going to focus too much on Unity and stuff. At this point, it's way more important to get more science going than anything else. Speaking of science, we have relatively decent uh, scientists. Looks like uh, the specializations actually match, at least for these two, so that is quite fine. We also have uh, mechanical scientists doing our engineering research, and it also looks like uh, this guy may come in and uh, try to invade me, in which case, now we're going to have to defend. So. At the very least, we're going to want to uh, get some armies going. If they actually invade me, I may have to declare martial law in order to uh, get more defense going. But otherwise, I think recruiting a few armies on each planet should be enough. Four should do it. Okay, let's do a little bit of that. Uh, according to Prime, if we lose it, uh, let's not lose it. Right, let's see. Uh, are they invading? Yeah, it does look like they're invading, uh, which is quite unfortunate. Receiving communications. Yeah, it looks like Nerzigil is giving me some alloys in order to help me resist. Unfortunately, we will be unable to resist. In fact, we'll cancel the starbase so that alloys don't get transferred. And our only chance at this point is uh, just martial law and resisting on planets. So let's go to decisions, declare martial law. This will cost us significantly in terms of production, uh, but it is worthwhile. Martial law on those two planets, and martial law. Let's let's hold off on martial law on this planet until they get relatively close. Uh, the thing with martial law is that I have to declare it preemptively, considering how uh, the soldier jobs uh, don't get immediately assigned. That's first and foremost, and uh, second, and. Uh, I, su I suppose second most, is that the defensive armies take some time to spawn in. So we're going to wait for that to happen. We're also going to want to make sure that the moment an army pops out of these planets, uh, it lets back. Exposed. Yeah, it looks like we are under invasion. Highly unfortunate. Uh, let's do some shenanigans with our fleets. Technology let's split this deployed. fleet into three. And uh, make sure we can ring ring uh, around the rosy if necessary spaceport under attack we'll leave these planets right here uh research some more wow that's that's a really bad technology suppose we can research some of this stuff uh we are at three wars yes as usual is this guy gonna advance yes this guy's advancing as expected why is the game paused the game is now unpaused all right Let's sell another artifact. Uh, I don't think it's wise to start building up anything because at this point we simply don't have the time to build up anything. However, it is wise to start landing these troops back in order to resist. I don't believe there's any edicts to improve troops, but I suppose I can uh, get some generals going if necessary. So let's do this. Our other colony is also almost complete. Do the same thing on it. Let's check the status of armies. So we have 222 garrison. That is just fine. Let's see. Ah, they are reinforcing. Uh, 
Uh, we're going to want to try to cut off their transports if possible. Alright, let's do this. That's reduced market fee, that's going to be excellent for buying more stuff. Alright, we didn't get the galactic market, unfortunately, but that's okay. Also, Enemy looks like this guy intends to send first. my economy down in the gutter. Fortunately, I am more or less prepared for this. But more or less, I think we can definitely resist at least one of their attacks. Uh, let me call down the whole federation into a chat and uh, I'll tell them to attack the transport fleets. Station under attack. If at all possible. So let's, uh, let's do that. Have a good time. All right. Uh, Federation, well, not Federation 1, East Burbs Federation. Let's go down to Diplo Fed 4. Okay. And let's coordinate. Zero G mineral production violently diminished. All righty. So uh, okay. I've just taken like five minutes to uh, talk to the audience. I've kicked up the min-max mode. Obviously, uh, being relaxed did not help me resist an invasion. So uh, we're, we're doing min-maxing. Um, okay. I would like you guys oh. to target the enemy transporter fleets if possible. Uh, I simply do not have the time to build up a fleet to defend myself, so I'll do the next best thing, which is to build up armies and defend my planets. Uh, I currently uh, have quite a bit of okay. armies, but if you cut off any and all reinforcements, uh, I'll be able to resist completely. Yeah, I'm probably dead here. Probably dead. Tempest. Uh, yeah. Rip. Enemy presence exposed. Enemy presence exposed. Attacking enemy. Oh, no. All right, looks like my ships are slower than his ships. That is unfortunate. Uh, I won't be able to completely evade him. Enemy presence exposed. Which sucks. All right, <laughs> so Pitiku, uh, thank you for the the fifty check. Privet for the bird. Yes, Privet. Although not in the, the Privet Comrade way, of course. Offer peace with the United Earth Directorate? Who is that? Uh, the Giant Federation of North. Ah, uh, what do they want? Uh, as far as I can tell, they just want my arm to the left, as far as I can tell. Uh, any planets or anything? Uh, two planets. Not much. Ooh. They were both very underdeveloped, not really. Um, alright. And you accept to that? To do this? Uh, they've, or they've essentially already taken the territory. There's nothing I can do to stop them. Alright. Yeah, we can vote yes on this one. Peace in our time. Peace in our time. <laughs> uh, uh, by the way, for anyone who's uh, asking in the chat, what kind of what, what kind of ballpark are three K fleets at this point? Uh, they're relatively uncommon. The only way you would get a three K fleet is if you dedicated your early game to getting a fleet. So this guy focused on getting a fleet specifically. He wasn't focused on building up yeah. economy or colonizing. He just focused on building up a big fleet. Which means that he intended to uh, go try hard and rush. Which is really unfortunate. Considering how this was meant to be a chill game. But I suppose that's not gonna, that's not gonna be the yeah, case. Yeah, they're all, they're all coming for you as well. <laughs> they're calling for me? What? Yeah, they're coming for you. Yeah, they're coming for me. Oh, well, lore keepers are gone. Rip lore keeper. That's one of the players.
Well, the first one, first player bites the dust, actually completely eliminated. Oh, really? Are you guys the yeah. southern verbs? Uh, we are the eastern verbs. Oh, okay, sorry. I'm we, are, we are the east you. block. Lost control of my capital. Yeah, if we if we surrender to uh, Creation Science Direct, it'll be completely just gimped. I'll only have my capital. Mm. That's a rip. Uh, what does Lyra want? Let's see. Ooh, Lyra wants to annex the Nerzagul. Interesting. Entirely? Uh, pretty much. They'll be leaving a single small planet. Jeez. Croatian has offered peace of conquering me. Well, just achieving his war goals, which is me only Attacking having my capital enemy vessels. And maybe one system. Vessels destroyed. We have white piece with. I see. Alright, so now we only have to focus against uh, the Spiffco. Oh, well, I get to keep one of my planets. It's the smaller of the two, but it's better than nothing. Yeah, the fleets of uh, the Spiffco are deep in t inside my territory, so you guys can start attacking uh, their, their lands. Enemy presence yeah, I don't have a bad. big fleet coming in, but I'll just annoy them in the back. Recon and research vessel under attack. <laughs> By the way, they they went for my capital, thinking they could capture the capital. Uh no, there's <laughs> there's an army everywhere. <laughs> Yes, they will not be able to capture. <laughs> nice. Martial law declared across the empire. Uh, but yeah, if you can, I'll start attacking their their systems. Like uh, Nerzigul, do you have a shipyard? Ah, uh, Nerzigul, you here? Yeah, my my fleet is. I'm not merciful, but my fleet is on its way. Alright, good. Uh, Nerd's goal. He might be AFK, which is unfortunate because he's in the chat currently. Not not the right timing, not the right timing. Not the right timing. Uh, because if he, he could have built up any fleets, it would have been excellent.
<laughs> one got kicked. This late, yikes. This late, yeah. Alright, let's see if there's gonna be an invasion going on. On Origin. If there's an invasion, then I'll be able to disable martial law. He might just be trying to bombard you. He might be. He might be uh, trying to just harm my economy. Uh, yeah. I mean, she did. I don't know if it's a girl. If, well, her name seems girl. Uh, she said in the game chat that she wanted to ruin your economy. All right. Well, I am preventing the economy from being ruined by uh, declare martial law. Like the the one thing that she can do is uh, invade with armies. Of course, by making me declare martial law. Uh, of course, it is hindering my empire, uh, but not in the same way as, you know, getting my planets invaded. I think that's what she was going for, considering how she buffed up her fleet, but I prevented that. I cut off uh, any passages of reinforcement. And now I can start building up more research. I have really been slacking on research this game, because uh, I was playing real chill, but looks like it'll have to be reversed. Yeah, it looks like she has blue lasers and auto cannons. And we auto cannons? The, Jesus. Uh, yeah. uh, I already have access to destroyers and blue lasers. I have access to most tier 2 already. Yeah, we're going to want to get the fleet up as soon as possible. Uh, we're going to need to level up our federation, uh, which actually is going to take quite a while. Considering how uh, disunited well, we are. It has a bit since the last time I looked. We're at it has, plus but nine right now. should be going up faster. But yeah, now unfortunately because... Oh, hold on, I just realized something. Uh, I was producing a lot of trade value, but that was collected. Because I didn't have any uh, range to collect them. Now, of course, during the war, uh, my capital is... Uh, is under bombardment, so I won't be able to do anything about it anyways, but... But you'll rectify that. But I will rectify that right after this war ends. And considering how I'm keeping their fleet in my systems, you guys have free reign. Uh, raiding the captured systems. Uh, Nerzigal, are you here yet? Ah, oh, God, that is that is really unfortunate. I wouldn't say we have free reign either. She has another 1k fleet patrolling her system. Ooh, I was not aware of that. But you gotta try to raid as many systems as possible uh, to prevent the surrender of uh, Nergazul. Yeah, Stefan is Stefan Nerzigo is uh, typing in Discord chat. He can't hear you via uh, YouTube. Ah, uh, what is he typing? Uh, he's yeah, that he's just listening via mobile. He's typing. Okay. I can you relay what he's typing? Cause I can't be reading chat and doing commentating at the same time. I'll, I'll look for you. I'll look for you. All right. I don't know, Clergy is saying in the chat, also min-maxing is still frowned upon. It's not min-maxing, it's uh, sweaty tryharding. That's exact. That's the one thing I wanted to prevent in this game, because I know like the people on the Grand Flotilla know how to min-max. I know the people on the other servers know how to min-max. But min-max is not the same as sweaty tryharding and getting a 3k fleet out the moment <laughs> the peace timer runs out. That is tryharding. That is what I wanted to try to prevent, but it looks like I only prevented it in the Grand Flotilla, which is... You know, kudos to me for being able to prevent it, but at the same time, yeah, it's, it's, it's a bit of a problem. Yourself. Yeah, okay, next time I'll be more clear to the other people, because I've told them to make sure there's no sweaty tryharding going on, but looks like it still happened.
I could send what's left of my fleet down, but that'd take, uh... What's going on, Stefan? Are you okay? Uh, yeah, uh, the only problem is, I I've talked to you and, uh, Lori to make sure there was no sweaty tryharding, and that's what we're seeing. Because I made it so abundantly clear to my people, uh, to not, like, min-max and be sweaty, that they're not min-maxing at all, which, which means that I overdid my job. Which is a bit Lord. unfortunate. And is... now we all suffer. And now we all Liar suffer. Did... Liar didn't come from uh, my pick of people, I believe. Yeah, so it must be from Lori's. But th the problem stays the same. I was not clear enough in communicating with you guys, uh, and I'm, I'm sorry for that. Yeah, uh, I was telling people to just go standard, do your normal thing, standard tournament, let's call it. Just be general, nice kind of thing. Don't be... But again, People's standard play style is actually yeah. pretty good when it comes to... No, again, the problem is... Stuff. The problem is, the one thing I wanted to prevent is people rushing down early. Which means that, like... That's why... I, this is the one thing. This is the one thing, goddammit. Like, people with uh, 3k why? fleets at year 20, exactly. That is what I wanted to prevent, but... Ah! That's why I always, that's why I always advocate. When I said uh, 30 years peace, it was not for, generally, like... For my players, it was for like the balance of the game. Because by year 22, it, you should have star holds, which would allow you to have defenses to defend off a 3k fleet. I suck at building fleets. So when people do that, like those armies, I had to have some sort of defense capability to fight it back against it. So I would always say 30 years peace. Therefore, I can get my defenses set up and hold them off by myself. Yeah, we should, we should have agreed to a 30 years peace, TBH. Yeah. When I, when I, my, we've done a lot of balancing, and, and I've played with a lot of players so mm -hmm. this is a good one. uh this sure. this is definitely a good good run to uh determine like things like that hmm. like th this is the uh, first test game of a 72 person game that's actually you know getting action so this is this is experience right here which is good i could technically have more paradox opens their limitation yes and uh, paradox and totally I should I have my sec they actually are aware of legends and the work I've been doing. I send them a lot of patch notes when it comes to errors and bugs they have, but I told them I don't want to be in the limelight just yet because of the fact. So it's great that you are handling YouTube because mm -hmm. for me, I'm just yeah, I'm too tired. <laughs> All this programming, man. Yeah, man. Like it's I, I respect the work. Like uh, the server is excellent for this sort of thing. It, it is perfect. The only thing that's not perfect is the, the hard cap on uh, the player empires, and if we talk to Paradox about it, I'm sure in like four weeks or so, when potentially the next game of this kind could start, we'll, we'll get something figured out. Basically what Paradox needs to do is basically reduce entity level, which is basically the spawning of multiple ships at the same time and issues that happen when there's so many. And when there's so much projectiles, those are also entities, and, mm -hmm. and it just compiles different systems that would actually projectiles into one projectile in order to reduce said entity. There's many things they could do for uh, display issues. Like if you zoom out, like five bullets will turn into one bullet instead, right? So mm -hmm. you wouldn't yeah. be able to tell, right? But that little bit of an effort for detail would affect greatly the SFX side. D definitely. But again, they're they're focusing on single player for the aspect of uh, like performance and visualization. Focusing on network protocols and trying to balance peer to peer network. And if someone's disrupting that like network game will struggle, either kick them out or pause the game or let them resync in. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But, so how are you doing, Lyris? Uh, 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 she used to play on server quite often. Haven't seen her in. Uh, by the way, uh, Chris, can you reconnect to the, the chat real quick? Uh, you're getting a bit sure. of robotting. Sure. Construction complete. Why was I going robot? Yeah, I have no clue, but like your, your voice was robotting. Sorry about that. Yeah, that's fine. I do hear an actual bird. Yes, it is, it is the holy burb herself. That is the reason why everyone is uh, is a burb empire in this thing. But yeah, see, with uh, integration and tournaments on our server, it's always been like serious because 
I always get free games out, and I'm giving a free game out too. If you, all your members and my members or Lori's members, whoever wins, is getting free shit at the end. It doesn't really matter. And that's what I said. So that's why people, I get a little bit competitive because when there's ever anything on the line, mm -hmm. even if I like emphasize calm thine tits, or pacify thine pecs, you know? Pacify uh, thine, I, I like that. Yep. Are you, wait, streaming was on the other server, right? You're not streaming right here, right? Or verbally streaming. I'm not sure. I am streaming, boy. Oh, Everything is live. <laughs> oh no! So, uh, so they, they heard my bad puns. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Okay, yes, I'm Canadian. We make bad jokes. Okay, okay. So back to <laughs> now back to the issue at hand. Uh, yeah, so the game's going good. They're excited to get this game out of the way. Again, are we gonna go for another hour, uh, or are we gonna nine minute save and wrap it up? Uh, is nine minutes? Oh, nine minutes is when four hours would have passed. Yeah. Hmm. All right, I'm gonna. Okay, we're gonna do two things. We're gonna ask the players, and we're gonna ask the audience. Like, I'm completely fine with streaming for another I could hour. Do totally a vote in my server as well, or actually, we could do a vote in the lobby chat. It's easier because the people in the game. Uh, yeah, I suppose we could do that. Uh, you can hold the vote there. I will ask the audience. So. Sounds good. Audience. Uh, what do you guys think? Do you want this stream to go on for an extra hour? Or do you want it to be wrapped up today? And, uh, well, today as in right now. And then uh, continue next week. Obviously, it's going to get wrapped up after an hour, even if you vote for... Communications. If you can vote one... The thing. To, yeah. Or two. So, let's see. Chat, of course, has some delay. Uh, so people are saying wrap it up a, a lot of people in the chat for the game are saying uh, wrap it up Let's see how's it going on uh, the Chris side of things we Okay, just, post we, we just posted the vote So one is continue two is to not continue. I'm gonna be also tracking my own chat Oh god, my, my plan is finally getting invaded. New. No. New. No. Oh god, oh god. Oh god. Alright, let me let me do my vote. I voted two as well because it makes it easier on me, because then I can uh go work on the new updates because we've got two new modes coming out featuring doomsday as like the main mm -hmm. like, that's what would be really cool is like trying out this new mode has like everyone spawning as doomsday starts where the worlds are gonna die and you have to escape to a new Colony venture to start and but there's also ai threats looming in the background that i've designed that will hunt down the players that are the most tech score the most savvy ready to expand yes yes that that, so, that is a that is a great idea uh but anyways built, yes mm -hmm. As far as the voting goes, okay, it looks like we have one dude spam and continue. Of course, a single vote counts for, yeah. a single person counts for one vote, but it looks like the other majority is saying uh, wrap it up. So we're going to wrap up the stream today uh, in seven minutes. So uh, I'll notify the, the people. So I'm going to hop into the, the normal chat and then we can continue Sounds on good. for another four hour session next week. So, Sounds good. All right, uh, we're going to wrap up the stream in six minutes. Uh, so do whatever you want to do uh, to finish up today, and then we're going to, of course, continue in the next week. Oh, uh, is that your voice? Nice. That is the Stefan voice. Uh, all right, we're going to wrap up in six minutes. Okay. That's so we're going to wrap up in six minutes. We're going to wrap up in six this. minutes. Uh, I'm just saying, we're going to wrap up the stream in six minutes. So. Oh, all right, okay. thank you. All right, thank you. Yeah, I had, I had to go through all the different voice channels to like talk to every single person. <laughs> We're gonna wrap up in six I minutes. We're gonna wrap up in six minutes. That's what's been going on. You should make a bot for that that just like plays a clip of your voice. Like, we're wrapping <laughs> yeah. up in six minutes. We're wrapping up in six minutes. Specifically, that one quote, nothing else. Yes. Like, you ask it any question and it just says we're wrapping we'll up. We'll wrap it up in six minutes. <laughs> Excellent awesome. idea. Stefan, does this constitute your definition of a chill game? Uh, no, this does not. I, I talked to Chris about this. <laughs> Basically, what we agreed upon is that I did too good of a job, uh, you know, inst instilling the chill into the the Grand Flotilla. 
And then yeah. they, they, okay, the thing that Chris said is play like you normally do, which unfortunately <laughs> is tryharding for his server. Yeah. So we're going to make it a, a bit more clear for the next stream and definitely once we do the next game, because this format is working out decently. Like we're getting through a decent amount of time with even with like 72 people, it's, it's going well. So there's probably going to be another sort of thing and hopefully it's going to be with 100 people. So we're going to try to talk to Paradox. Uh, but yeah, uh, it was just a mis miscommunication, and uh, the Grand Flotilla got a little screwed over. Yeah. Help me. <laughs> yeah, help, help please. I looked around, and my first two contacts were both meritocracy, technocracy, materialists. Oh god. Materialists. Yeah, yeah no, this is this no. is what I wanted to prevent. Yeah. Just I'll go for the meta. <laughs> They're literally meta meta gaming, but that's that's fine. I mean, they they weren't warned that they should not be uh, meta gaming. They were warned to play normally, which is meta gaming. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. I'll I'll tell the same thing in the general multiplayer chat. And actually, um, all of you can come up to the general multiplayer chat. I'll tell everyone else to do the same thing. Okay. All right. So uh, can everyone one? hold on? Hold on. Uh, can everyone get up to the normal multiplayer chat? Yeah. Thank you. He's upgrading. Alright, uh, everyone get up to the regular multiplayer chat. Please. Okay. Regular multiplayer chat. For uh, four minutes, the game will be saving and shutting down, yes? Yes, in four minutes, we will save and shut down the game. Finalize um, everything you need to do. Finalize everything. Uh, I would like to end with a final statement. I'm sure my audience has already heard this like two times already, but uh, there was a bit of a miscommunication. With the format of this game, this was meant to be a chill game. Unfortunately, uh, some of you might have thought that this was supposed to be a normal sort of game, and normal for you in, is min-maxing and rushing people down with 3k fleets at year 20. Uh, so, in the next time we do such a game, it's going to be a bit more clear on the rules, because right now, as you have noticed in the galaxy, the Grand Flotilla people have been chilling, expecting a pretty chill game, while the other servers have not been doing the same thing so we're going to make it more clear for the next time and uh, in fact for the next stream is going to be well actually you know let, let's continue with the total war for the, the next stream let's get this uh series to be a war one and then the next series will be the one that i envisioned uh because of course considering how well this game is running like we're probably going to be doing another stream and hopefully it's going to be a 100 person stream uh, after we talk to paradox about it but yeah <laughs> You know, hopefully, hopefully they watch the stream. Hopefully they watch the stream. It's a 100-person uh, um, galaxy with all pacifists. All pacifists. This does kind of put uh, those of us who built for more of a chill game at a disadvantage. Yeah, yeah that's the problem. Basically, the whole flotilla. Like, okay, look. If if you see if you see anyone from the Grand Flotilla, like they're playing a burb empire, xenophobic and memeing. All right. So there's clear evidence of miscommunication here. But anyways, uh, stream is going to be wrapping up very soon. Uh, thanks for everyone. Thanks everyone for watching. Uh, obviously, thanks everyone for participating. And uh, wrap up anything you need to do in the last two minutes. And then um, we're going to be pausing the game then, saving and uh, ending the stream. Are there any... Okay, actually, I'm going to ask Chris and Lori to do any last statements. Chris, do you have anything to say? Uh, yes. Uh, thank you for everything for participating. It was great seeing you all out today, and we will see you guys next Saturday at Lori's Multiplayer Games. Of course, remain integrated if you are still alive uh, and wish to participate next Saturday. Uh, besides that, I will be hosting another game to, like, a dedicated session that will last the last players alive for people that want to get those Penta Aggression. So, we'll save this game here uh, right now, uh, since it's now the minute point, and mm -hmm. we're finalizing everything. Good luck. I mean, sorry. Uh, thanks for everything. Uh, Lori, any last words? Lori? Uh, well, yeah, obviously I'll see you next week since I'm, I, I just am hosting, well, not hosting, obviously, but, uh, well, hosting you all for the next game. Um, so I hope to see you all there. And I, I do have something very, very special planned for you all. So I, I hope. <laughs> Excellent. We'll get to see that next week. But if you are uh, if you are interested in joining any one of the three servers, and in fact you should be joining all three servers, links are all in the description. Anyways, Alrighty. thanks everyone for go. watching, and uh, the game is getting saved right now, as we speak. And, and of course, 
everyone can say a goodbye at this point. Goodbye. Bye. 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 Goodbye. Goodbye. Praise Burb. Bye. 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 Please. Bye. Right. Goodbye. <laughs> Hello. Anyways. Hello. Best what do you mean, hello? Alright, anyways. Thanks everyone for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.